ask you a question? Why you don't never play with my nipples? I got nipples too. It's my turn to get tied up. Not the handcuffs though. I got PTSD. Welcome to Heart of Soul, where men speak. So hopefully somebody will understand. Oh my God. Back in the okay. goddamn. No, no. I'm doing okay. I did it. All right. Nigga. We're not ready I yet. Did it. No, oh, you a hater. Such a, a piece patriot. of shit, son. How does it feel to be a hater? Now I know exactly how it feels to be a Laker. Oh. oh. Now I know exactly how it feels to be a Laker. You know what happened to me this weekend? Yeah, I do. Well, a couple things. This one I didn't tell you about. What? I'm in the, I'm in the, I'm in Kingston Drinks. Oh. A friend of ours approaches me. Yeah. Grabs me and goes, yo, I don't like how you talk to Carmelli. And yeah. I said, how do I talk to Carmelli? And I was like, I don't think Carmelli would agree with what you're saying. But I, for the sake of it, I was like, I, I get what you're saying. I ain't gonna I hold you. Somebody pressed you at Kingston. <laughs> yes, bro. <laughs> Press me, bro. Yo, wait, first of all, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna hold tell you who up. off air. No, wait, wait, who. wait, 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 wait. Welcome Sorry. back, y'all. We back. It's gonna be a short episode this week because I'm still in the afterglow. Facts. Still, I just woke up. Still tingling. Don't touch me. Yo, I came in. My man said, nah, I can't touch you right now. My hands on my I'm skin. I'm still tingling because the live show was lit. Yeah. Super fucking lit. Congratulations, bro. You had your first live yes, show. Yes, I did. On stage. How, how'd you feel? Felt right at home, to be honest, man. Um, felt really good. It was exactly how I pictured it going in my head. So yeah. I'm happy that for once something went how I seen it playing out. Yeah, so you stepped up to the plate and you mm -hmm. killed. Yeah, we, we did our thing, man. knocked it down. We did our thing. We, yeah. we really not checked all boxes. You checked off boxes that uh, uh, I didn't check off. Uh, okay. What the fuck was that shirt about? <laughs> Yo, what look. the fuck would you wear <laughs> that shit? Looking all goddamn. Oh my God. Nigerian. Yeah. That shit looked like them special Japanese Crocs that is out right now. <laughs> it's such a Croc. Yo, I have Hold never on. received. Let me that shirt. I'm about to go get that shirt. How you about to go get it? Oh my God. What the fuck? I have never. <laughs> Yo, son. She that Lou's outfit <laughs> for the live show. Yo, this is son. what Lou wore, and it had shoulder pads that went up like this. Son. Yo, did you guys watch Fifth Element? Yes, yes, yes. That, was him. yes that was me. I have never received so much. Con I, that might be the most controversial thing I've ever worn in my life. Like it's, it's literally like comedies. a 50 50 split. I love that. Mad people loved it. A lot of people hated it. And it was exactly what exactly I wanted. Exactly what you're supposed to do. That's like what I wanted. People's you calling me. You can't yeah, fall into fashion. You, you have to create fashion. You gotta do your own you thing. You have to do your own thing. Do your and, own I, thing. I, and I respect that you did that, bro. It says a lot. It says a lot. You know what kind of motivated me to do that, though? Drake. You ever like realize whenever Drake like got, he got like a different hairstyle. Like sometimes it's a heart, low season, yeah, braids. Yeah, so yeah. like we always have something to pinpoint yeah. this point in time in his career. I, I need something I can like pinpoint back to this. I, I find I find I, I find this to be interesting, Melly. Yeah. Do you pick what he's doing again? What? I'm we not, mentioned I'm, it during the live show. I'm not doing what I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. You're dick gauging. Oh my <laughs> Again. <laughs> Why Jesus do you care so Christ. much about how other niggas fuck their chick? Or I how did... they fucked her, or how they might be fucking her. <laughs> how do we get like, it? Where did his style come from? Like, I might want to do something like that. Why do you care so much about how other niggas do? I look at man shit for inspiration. Let me ask you a question. You Next gotta question. ask. Mm -hmm. Her nigga bigger than you or sexier than you. My ex. A new nigga. My ex is new nigga. Yeah. That make you feel away? <laughs> it makes you feel the way you're like oh, this nigga be killing my bitch I, 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 I ain't gonna be like hmm I'm like mm, you really be imagining if he killing you go back to thought, thinking about what yeah thoughts cross my mind that. yeah why do you dick gauge so much bro what's only, wrong with oh, you? not with all the only maybe like with one I'm like mm, I wonder if she doing what I think she doing you be imagining her sucking his dick nah cause the head wasn't all of that I thought was, everything else is fine. Like, I wonder if she be riding that nigga like that. She be imagining if the head is better. <laughs> <laughs> yo, you ever, I, like, yo, you got practice? Yo, like, yeah. you just, you just yeah. nice now? Have you ever had somebody get practice on you? Come back with better skills? Yes, yes, yeah, mm -hmm. word. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I was sitting here like, damn, it's been a while. 
Like, Man, it's nothing like it's nothing really like the ones that you train though. Facts. The ones that you teach how to please you, and they learn, and they actually like they studying mm-hmm. your body, they studying yeah, yeah. your kinks, they studying your likes, mm-hmm. and then y'all break up, bro. You really never know how much information you've downloaded into your perfect child. Fuck, child. They know everything about you. Word. They know what you like. They know what you don't like. They know how you like to be touched. They don't, you know, don't like to be touched. And then you you lose them. So you just out here giving uh, these default settings cloud. to another nigga. Blood cloud. This is what you. This is what we do. <laughs> you just gonna give your default settings See, to another. You doing nigga. it again? You worried about what she doing, another nigga? Yes. No, yes. I'm worried about you I, doing it with me. You was gonna do that with another nigga regardless. Uh-oh. That's that was that was always gonna happen. I'm the another nigga now compared to the last nigga that she was fucking with. I'm the other nigga. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I get what you're saying. Because she was fucking with somebody before me, so why do you care so much? I don't know, bro. I don't know. No, nah, I feel like that gives too much power. Like, I don't know. Gives That's too much power wondering. to other people. I, I'm worried about how you feel about me. I'm not worried about how you dealt with somebody else. I'm not worried about what y'all experiences was or what your history was. We talk about you feel ex, like, Unless we talk like that and we just throwing it around. You know what I mean? Like, oh yeah, we did this together once. But you said your ex with a new nigga. Yeah. Not your current chick with you now. If you with me now, I'm not thinking yeah. about what you used to do. If your ex, you see her with a new nigga, you used yeah. to fuck with her. Yeah. They pass you on no Nostrum, Marcy, or whatever happens. Yeah. You see her with the nigga. You be watching how niggas walk if they bow-legged and all that. Yeah. <laughs> Walking like Dominique you Wilkins. Be, so you don't watch a nigga, <laughs> this nigga walking crazy like, with your ex. Like, you like, like, I know nigga, this nigga be kicking <laughs> shit like, to that bitch. Like, this nigga knock me? Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? This, <laughs> this nigga kicking all types of moves in that like, Oh, he got flat feet. <laughs> <laughs> this weekend, oh, oh man, son. yo, that last year. First of all, I can't believe you had beef at Kingston Drinks. Yes, yes, yo, she really pressed me. I'm gonna tell you who it is off air, and I was like, really? Mm. You feel like that? And I wasn't. It wasn't really the space for me to like host a healthy debate. So I was like, ah, right, yo, I, I'm, I'm gonna take note and move forward. Why don't nobody care about how Melly be hating on me all day? Nobody says nothing like yo, Melly. Why you hate on Tahoe? Or no. they'd be like, hate on him more. Get him. Yeah, girl. I'm like, what the fuck? Does right, they, have they ever come up to you and be like, um, kill. Get him. Do, do right and kill everyone. Do right. <laughs> <laughs> do Drake. Tahoe. Do Drake. right and kill everything. Do they Drake do that him. to you, uh, Melly? No, there's no reason for them to come up to me because I don't be doing nothing wrong to you. Satan, huh? They know you need no I don't motivation. Do anything wrong to right. you. Okay. I don't do anything. Yeah, no, no, no. You need no motivation. They, they see, they, they know what I be doing for you. So, yeah. Okay, Carmelli. Um, so successful event. What did you like about the event? Shit, it's moments kinda... that you liked. I ain't going front. You getting your dick sucked on stage might have been probably one of the biggest. That's what the happened. fuck is going on? Don't do that. All right, listen, guys. If you were no, no, if you weren't there, uh-uh. it was supposed what? to be a little person. We supposed to have a little person, and he 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 didn't show up. Don't say too much. Man. All right, so okay, so I was forced into a position. That's what happened. All right, so all right, so anyway, um, <laughs> <laughs> when yeah, that was the tough. fucking comedian had Shorty do dick you up on stage and call her nigga. Son, <laughs> son, son. Nah, don't say. Don't let's not let's not say. Let's not no, say. Wait. Let's not let's not give him too the much. Nigga asked, give him too much. She was like, uh. Scale of one to ten, how good is my sex <laughs> on stage? The nigga said, when you were up, <laughs> when you're awake, when you're awake. <laughs> and this nigga, like, he call, she calls him out the blue. This nigga has no idea what's son, going on. Oh she calls him God, out the blue on stage God. to win the prize. And she asks him, like, yo, you know, I just want to know, you know what I mean, what you think about our sex life. Like, rate our sex right now. One from zero to ten. This nigga sleep. He like, huh? What? She like, rate our sex life right now, like, from zero to ten. This nigga said, when you awake, <laughs> <laughs> like nigga, yo, when yes. I tell you the crowd went nuts. Like, I was sitting here like, what? <laughs> nigga, what? After you fight, what did you think about Kingston Drinks? Oh yeah, it was, um, that shit was tough. I ain't gonna front. That, that was definitely a, uh, an experience. Shout out to Sir Marvelous. An experience. My brother, um, man, I feel so amazed by your talent, um, by your um, awareness of the female body. 
You know what I'm saying? Like you really get it. And I was paying attention to how you and Siphon and uh, Kasha, the Enchantress, y'all seeing it at, at Kingston Drinks went. And I am um, a student. I am a student, bro. I'm paying attention. I love pleasuring women. I think it's amazing. And I realized that the soft touches, the thing, the soft things that you do with women <clears throat> affect them so much more than the heart. Yeah. Like, I've been doing this all my life, mm, mm, mm -hmm. mm, 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 which is dope. Fire. But there's mad other things that, that affect women in so many ways and yeah. get them foreplay, their body going crazy. And I'm like really into studying that shit now, like touching their points that make them go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you saw what Yo-Yo just wrote? I had to dodge <laughs> siphon squirt. I didn't sign up for that. <laughs> Son. Oh my God! <laughs> so it was a great. So it was. A, it was a great. Wait, f four. What did yeah. you think about four? Yo, shout Coming out to, to the live show. Shout out to my man four, man. Shout outs to four. And I say all the time, it takes a real nigga to do some of the things it is that he does. And I don't think I'm that real yet. I'll say that. So you're on hardest Sore podcast. Yeah. You are talking to another nigga about what makes your dick hard every week? Yeah. But what? what you he, about? But what he did? goes way beyond what we do. Well, I wouldn't say it's just necessarily what he did, but it's definitely him, Mr. Smarley, Correct. Uh, Goddess Rue, Goddess Bria. They put on the show Yo. Uh, with Four. So Facts. yes, and everybody loved Four. So hopefully, bro, um, if you're out there and you're listening, yes, they are going crazy right here in the Discord. Um, Hito, I will get you the, the the name of the ladies who did fire play in the room next to you. Shout yes, out to Hito. we had wax play, electro play, fire play, masseuse, bro, crazy ass. So, Every so, time. so it was great. It was great. It was great. It was great. It was a great weekend. Did you get? Did your dick get wet? What do you? What do you? Wait. <laughs> did you get you, some pussy this weekend? Like, did you? Oh, oh. <laughs> did okay. you take it wet? Or, or did you think that I meant like, did you get wet because yeah, the I was show was fire? like. Uh yeah, I, you know what's funny? This weekend, no, bro, I ain't gonna lie, I was so tired. Yeah, like this weekend, no, but I ain't gonna hold you. I definitely read up and got some good back pay yesterday. Woo, good back pay. You know when you get paid for the shit you used to, you did? Like I got my pussy from this weekend yesterday. Oh, yeah, some back box. Yeah, yeah, that shit was definitely that was yeah. fire. I was on some shit. Wait, so who Ooh. initiates on the the back pay of pussy? Does she push it? Does she throw it on you? Or do you I, say, you know what? You owe me some pussy. I pressed the button. <laughs> Bing. And all I was press the button. And she just reacted. And it was on. Then I hit it with the, nah, I was just fucking with you. I'm mm -hmm. good. She said, no, no, you were not. Mm -hmm. No. And I was sitting here like, I'll get you tomorrow. You know, often on the show we talk and I realize mm -hmm. that you be not wanting to fuck more than you be wanting to fuck. It's you be like, I'm tired. I don't like obligation pussy. No, <laughs> not right now. <laughs> no, I ain't a long no, day at work. No. Like, you like, I'm you're a the girl in a relationship. I'm a bitch. I'm so, a bitch. But, but why? I thought that, it, does it, has it gotten to the point where lady, women are like, like trying to force you, women that you're having sex with, mm -hmm. are like, yo, you need to fuck this pussy. Like, has it gotten that far? As of lately, for, it's definitely more them wanting to fuck them you want to fuck yeah now when you say that i think about it why yo i ain't gonna hold you bro between like what we got going on and just how life has been the, the direction that life has been going to as of lately it just isn't i don't have as much free time to do that as i would like to how long does sex take bro you said what how long does sex take let's be real how long is a sex tape how long does sex take oh like, let's be oh real. oh nigga um about 45 minutes a good session a good minutes? session. Yeah. All right, that's cool. 45 I don't minutes, do hour yeah. change, whatever it may be. But a regular session. It's 37. I was, 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 was going to be like 33. <laughs> I don't know what you want me to say here, bro. This is yeah. what I be doing. <laughs> Boy, yeah, then you know what it is nah, too. Like, you get a good little 12 to 18 minute session in, in the morning. You or, do that? Yeah, in the morning. Hell yeah, a little 12 minutes. Come here. Especially if it's like bae. Y'all both get off in 12 minutes? If it's Bay, she getting off. Maybe, oh. I, maybe I'll be showing off. Maybe I'll be trying to do too much. But once, like I said, once you know your person's spots, yeah, it doesn't take much for them to, you know what I mean? That's like I was talking to um, Gatorade and she was mm -hmm. telling me how a lot of times, you know, she be trying to interact. Um, 
it takes more foreplay for her than for the other person. So a lot of times it's like it, she needs to warm up faster because oh. by the time that person gets the foreplay that she was giving them, they give it back to her. She ain't really foreplayed up yet. She ain't all the way up and it's time to start the action oh. and she isn't getting all the way there. You know what I'm saying? But me and her know each other bodies yeah. well enough so we don't have that issue. Mm -hmm. So Everything reminds me of him. <laughs> 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 okay. Um, <laughs> what else? Um, things you didn't like about live, um, the last show. What, what 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 would you have liked to see more of next time? Mm, you know, <clears throat> I remember one time a really good friend of ours had gave a comment one of our play parties, mm. and she was saying she feels as though we could have did a better job touching on all five senses. Mm -hmm. It was I a white room. I hate that white room. Yeah, that's what it was. I white would, room. And I'm looking at the visuals, mm -hmm. and I'm like, man, we had a white background. This is why I would love to do more professional space next time. Atlanta, Philly, Chicago, D.C. Be prepared. Shout out to the space that we did have, though. Love Shout it. out to them. Shout out to them. Yeah. But um, be prepared. Mm -hmm. Maybe uh, like smell. DR. You know, oh. Um, be prepared. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Um, we're coming to have a good time. I, I will say this, though. We have now closed out our live show for the 2023 year. We did our first show. Mm -hmm. I thought it was amazing. Shout out to um, Aisha, Fifi, Melly, um, Butter, um, Shug. Sh <laughs> shout out to everybody that helped us. Um, shout out to Jax and Nick um, from Philly that, to, that recorded. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, shout out to everybody. But I've been thinking about, okay, our next event is in February. It's early December. Less than two months. We ain't gonna play party forever. <clears throat> Except I'm kind of. I, I I would like to discuss. I would like mm -hmm. to discuss. How long do you think you would accept a person being at the same level, your partner, being at the same sexual level, and not get better, up. not leveling up? before it becomes like they really just not paying attention to you, your body, or there's a deal breaker. A month. Like, you know what, you, a month. Yeah. Why? What if they cool in <clears throat> a month? It's four weeks, they was cool in four weeks. Why are you firing them after four weeks? Um, I'm not saying you gotta be stellar, but you gotta at least be taking baby steps. But you haven't taken that one baby step, you haven't asked what's one the entry, question. What's the entry step of pussy? Entry step of pussy for you. Give me entry step um, to one T, T-Y, one, one Y. The zero to three month sex to one year sex. What is the natural progression of pleasure? For me? Mm -hmm. Oh shit. <clears throat> Bro, I ain't gonna hold you. Like, what do you want to see them improve at yeah. over that? Um, you gotta at least know, so here's the thing. You gotta at least know how, what my button is. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So like, there's a button that you can press if I'm not in the mood to get me in the mood. Is it? Yes. Don't say it's the back of your kneecaps. No, that's bro, man. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do me like that, like, but. I was dealing with a girl for a month. She ain't lick my nipples not one time. I'm like, yo, like, you didn't even Did you bother. tell her you like your nipples? Like? I see, I said it. Said it in casual conversation. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what She's I'm saying? I dropped it. Yeah, not paying attention. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a month in, you haven't even like touched them yet? Like, <laughs> nah, I'm good. Like clearly, I'm not that. I'm not that important sorry, to you. Buddy. Not that important to you. Touch them was crazy. You ain't touch them yet. Like, <clears throat> I'm not that important to you. No, no I'm not that important to you. What? No. Men really didn't. Why are we? Are, why, why are you complaining? Because yo, you didn't touch my nipples in a month. Yo, like this is what we doing. This is what we used fuck? to be kings. I'm, I'm still him. <laughs> I'm just him with some nipples. Um. Yeah, you got you got four. You got thirty one. The reason days. I brought that up is because it's like yo, we've been doing the same play parties. We were saying they novice play parties. Same thing, you come in, you go to the different rooms, cool, fire, dope, you know what I mean? But I just been thinking like, yo, what is the natural progression? Like, where does this go? Like, I, I wouldn't do a different type of play party. Mm, I see what you're saying. I actually wouldn't do a party. So so I was watching, so I was watching porn, as I knew as normally. It's been a while since I got some box. Um, I actually <laughs> got some box the other day. Thank God. Um, thank God. Thank God for raw sex. Um, okay. I pulled it close to me. Okay. And as soon as I touched it. You was ready. I nutted. 
<laughs> yeah, nothing, say I'm sorry while you're mad. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. Yo, <laughs> nah, nah, you like, yo, my, nah, my, my fault, my fault. <laughs> Pardon me, pardon me. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> my bad. My nah, bad. you gotta be shocked. Like, damn, what happened? <laughs> um, so yeah, um, yeah, that happened. Um, but yeah, I was watching porn, mm -hmm. and I seen a party where everybody's partying, but as they're partying, they're also fucking. People sucking dick on the dance floor. People's fucking at the bar, watching, <laughs> waiting to get their drinks and somebody sitting there fucking at the bar what do you think about this what do you think about this it reminds me of, i don't know this didn't quite happen in the show but like you remember in the falls of house of usher yeah when the little nigga was throwing yes. a party i went to a party like that yeah it kind of get i wanted to be in a party like that oh, kind of give me a party, party like, like that. that yeah um real great show by the way i yes yeah yes great show um melly hi how are you do you have your mic what do you think about this idea of being in a play party and you can actually dance, um, stand around, you don't have to do nothing all night, but all around you, there are things happening all around you as you're dancing. What do you think about that? I think that would be dope. Um, like when you say all around you, like do they, do they just start? Fucking like right there, or do they right move there. to the side? Like, what do they do? <laughs> don't fuck around the floor. Oh my god! Somebody gosh. said, "Don't fuck around my food, my dude." Dance floor, okay, next to my libations. I don't know. First of all, Ty, yo, dick on the wings is crazy though. Yeah, that's kind of crazy. It's kind of tough. Uh, is it? Look the Chipotle. I might try to put some Lick the Chipotle off my balls. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying, yo. but um, that's fine. I I, I had a vision. Millie, what do you think? Like I just I just had a vision because my favorite position is um um how do you call it damn it standing up from the back well not standing up but I just had a vision like yeah. if you you at the you bar know, you, you're trying to get your shit and somebody just come up behind you and was like yo and they just <laughs> well, funny you do say that since we're on the topic of sex and food why are you changing the topic because I have a video but I'm not done talking about my play party it's gonna relate to this though All right, good. I promise you. Hold that thought. He's trying to kill a playboy. My boyfriend and I eat in bed. <clears throat> if we're high, we may include food in our set play and fall asleep with crumbs on the sheets. Oh, my God. Oh, tell me about it. He was going down on me when he swears he saw a cockroach come out of me. Wow. Huh? Wow. Wait, how are you wow. that? Wait, yeah, what? why would you get this one? <laughs> right now, we have sexy. roaches. So maybe a roach came. The confidence to say I oh, may have God. roaches is nuts. Oh. I may have roaches, so maybe a roach oh, right. came out from under the crease oh, my slash God. fold in my stomach. But I, if I, if I, I thought you were yeah, talking yeah, about yeah, dudes. Yeah, 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 <laughs> this is what Bloom decides to want to talk about while we talk about being sexy. This has gone from bad to worse. <laughs> What's wrong with this man, bro? And you still Tell me about it, bro. Bro, oh. Continue. The confidence to type this out what? argues that it definitely crawled out from inside of me <coughs> and he won't see me again without uh, a doctor's oh, note. <laughs> that's, oh, God, that's 10 toes. They should press you about shit like this. Like, what? <laughs> this makes no sense. I am disgusted <laughs> for several different reasons. It's not one, it's not even two. It's at least four or five reasons I'm disgusted. <laughs> Why would you write that letter? I would never. Why would you want anybody to know? I would never write that. Who is going to give me that? But I would not go to the doctor. I mean, I think I may have larvae in there. I don't think that I would. I think I saw a roach egg in my vagina. I'm not going to say it. This is going to be one of those things that we're going to, it's going to be the elephant in the room. It's going to be the roach in the room. Because I'm never going to tell nobody that a roach just crawled down your dick out my pussy. Like, I'm not doing it. That's one of those things you got to diagnose on Google. Like, yo, what yeah, happens yeah, yeah. if I'm you going with, see... Whatever Waikipedia says. Google says take a shower. All right, fuck it. Of I'm not. I'm, what would you do? <laughs> Apple cider vinegar. Yo. <laughs> Apple cider vinegar. <laughs> castor oil. <laughs> I'm walking. I ain't gonna hold you. I'm walking my pussy through the fire. <laughs> through, the, through the candles like that video. <laughs> I'm trying the to world six in dark. I'm walking through the candles like... like the yeah. world six in dark. Oh, no, no, well, no, no, no. What, what, what would you do, though, if that's your partner? 
uh, move to another. Are we talking about in the play bar? <laughs> because a roach come out, I'm acting like I hope I'm not. I'm the only one that's seen that motherfucker. Nigga, yo, Loon, what you say? Because <laughs> I'm not pointing like, yo, you got a roach in your pussy. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> nah, you got, you got, you got to know that niggas in there. You got to know. You thought you, this is threesome? That's, that's not the worst that's threesome not, I've ever seen. <laughs> the fuck? I'm out of here. I imagine she's like, uh, she like, uh, slap go shit. harder. Remember, that wasn't me, ma. <laughs> Remember I used to slap pussy before? Please. Stop. I'm on some. I'm shit. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on some shit. Slap down. <laughs> is it? All right. Oh my god. All right. So yeah, I was thinking about doing the um Ladies, I'm sorry that Loon is a somewhat tone deaf. Um, I thought it was funny when it comes to us talking about being sexy and doing sexy things what I was saying is I would like to know what y'all think if we do a real party but there is it's a no holds bar party you can do whatever you want dance but during the dancing it's a party party but while this is going on now how long do you think that if somebody was making out next to you and you had somebody next to you, how long before their making out next to you turns into you making out with the person you're with? Fun fact, that actually sounded like that actually happened before. I went to like a rave in mm -hmm. Williamsburg. You know, there's a difference between partying and raves. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kid you not, this couple was on a couch just like this, they kissed for like 45 minutes straight. Mm -hmm. Like I'm talking about like just straight, like mm -hmm. they didn't come up for air or nothing. Mm -hmm. And I look at the girl next to me, I was like, yeah, they, they just kissing. <laughs> <laughs> I, was like, I, was like, I was like, yeah, you know, they just there kissing and mm -hmm. shit, you know what I'm saying? It's like, yeah, oh my God, they've been kissing for forever. And I was like, yeah, you know, it's, it's not wrong with kissing. I, um, and she was like, um, yeah. And then she just left. <laughs> she, we never kissed. I was so mad. I wanted to kiss so bad. She did so. not take cues. She did take cues. Oh, bitch. Yeah, this is a girl I was fucking. And she just walked away? So got me so mad, son. I will tell you an example of me going through the same thing, but it is not as pathetic as yours. I, I must say. I'll be pathetic Respectfully. sometimes. I'll be Respectfully. pathetic. I'll be pathetic. I'm in the limo going to the Shorty I'm Dating's prom. Damn, that's a minute ago. Young, years ago. Yeah. This, this is when ago. I knew I was bugged out. Eons ago. This is when free... God damn it. Nigga, kids don't take kids don't take limos no more. That's how old damn we it. are. They don't, right? They take Bentleys no more. Yeah, they right? do cars and horses and <laughs> shit. Like damn, Rari. I am <clears throat> in the back seat of a car, of the limo. I'm in the back of the limo. Mm -hmm. My back is to the partition where the driver is. So the driver's yeah. right here. She's right here. I'm here. Her friend is in front of us. So her friend is sitting towards the trunk. Yes. With her boyfriend. Mm -hmm. And I'm sitting towards the back. So towards the front. So y'all are here and they're here. Yes. Y'all facing each other. And she, her friend started making out with her man. I think after the prom. Mm -hmm. And we're just watching. <laughs> Cause they're directly in front of us. Like what are you gonna do? It's what a limo, there's no way to turn, you know what I mean? Damn. We're watching. They're making out and oh. shit and we watching. She starts rubbing on my leg. We start making out, but we up it. They had a kiss off. Nigga, she climbed on my lap. We never had sex before. What? And on the prom, we never had sex before going to prom. What? Bro, she climbed on my lap and rode my shit with her head through the partition window. And I'm looking at her friend. Like, yeah. And her nigga. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. Drive a roll down the partition, please. <laughs> that that must have been, what when, when, when a prom year? 16, 17? 17, 18. Something like that? Yeah. 16, 17, right? Mm -hmm. Who's doing shit like that? Like That's unheard of back me then. Me and her was in that car wilding. They got out. They got to the spot we was going. They got out. We and her wilding. In the back. That was your first time fucking? And that was our first time fucking. I and know. our last time. I don't think we ever had sex again. I don't wife that after that. I probably would have. Yeah. We was friends. Because... You ever, when you was young, you know you date somebody for mad long. Mm -hmm. You ain't really think about fucking. You yeah. just dating for mad long. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we was dating for like a year. <laughs> we was we was boyfriend and girlfriend for like a year. No fucking. But my no funny shit, bro. Can you imagine you're driving right, and somebody's head comes through next to you through the partition, and you could tell that they riding, yeah. they could ride in dick, it's and like, she's making noises and shit. Like, and you're driving. I'd be like, bitch, I'm trying to put the blinkers on, bro. 
nuts scene. That's probably fire. And that was very young. And so since then, I've been chasing nut scenes. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you think that's one nut of your villain scenes, origin stories? That's a fucking, that's a bar. Is that one of your villain origin Isn't stories? Nut villain? scenes. Double entendre. There that's a double go. entendre? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yeah, I would say something like um, I wouldn't say that's my 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 origin story though. I think for I like have, wild shit though. My origin story started when I was a virgin. It wasn't like that though. Shorty came to my crib with my man a week, two weeks, maybe a month after we graduated sixth grade. Comes to my crib with my man. My man got his shorty. She's with them. They come mm-hmm. in the gate downstairs. My man is just laughing like, yo, sure they got something for you. I don't even, me and her never <laughs> fucked with each other. Sure they got something for you. <laughs> That's exactly what he said. Something like that, because he didn't tell me, yo, you about to get yeah. some pussy, yeah. and I'm a virgin. So we've never had this type of interaction before. Mm-hmm. He's showing up with a chick. So obviously, Shorty was like, where is he at? Mm-hmm. I'm fucking him. And she, he went and got and brought it to my crib. And my man is like, yo, sure they got something for you. Well, I tell you, she grabbed me by my hand, took me in the back room. My bed at the time was wooden. But it had no legs. It wasn't made like that. They were broken. The fucking wood <laughs> it broke. was on piles of books. <laughs> Yo. Every nigga's had a bed on top of yeah, something. It was on bricks. It was, it was on bricks. Yeah, like bricks. Uh-huh. Like cinder blocks. Yeah. So she takes me mm-hmm. to the book. The book written bed. Or the, yeah, the bed written book. I don't know. Yeah. Anyway. And she fucked me, bro. But before she fucked me, bro, I ate that pussy, bro. What? Your first time? My very first having sex, I ate pussy, bro. You lying. It tasted horrible. Yeah. T- I yo. never tasted nothing like it. Yeah. It I never. Want, I felt like I licked the bottom of a garbage can. I promise yo. you. I've never, because I like sugar. Yeah. I'm big on taste. Sweets. So I go, the I've fuck is that? I never tasted nothing like that before. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yo, what, what is this? So I'm down there and I'm just like, mm-hmm. And I'm just like, Ugh. what is this? I climbed in. We start knocking. <laughs> That's what your little fresh ass gets. Look at this. <laughs> Yo, shut up. Yeah, hey, I must have been 12, 13, whatever. I don't even think I was 13 yet. I must be 12. But um, then we start rocking, and I'm killing her shit. We, yeah. I'm in there. Uh-huh. And the bed slips off the books. <laughs> <laughs> the whole bed hit the floor. Boom. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> but she was fucking. No, about. wait. But it is. Why we fucking? And wait, but she was a bigger girl. Mm-hmm. This, I think, is why I always said I, I like big girls. I don't have a problem with big girls. Like, I actually enjoy it. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? So she was a bigger girl. So you just imagine how that looked. Oh, my God. We both God. hit the floor. She was Complex. Like, <laughs> Complex. <laughs> Nigga, she got out the bed, and they all left. Um, obviously, they didn't help me f- fix my bed. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. They tried it. <laughs> but <laughs> but what, uh, what? Yeah, so I think that's where my village and origin story. You got to imagine. Because when I came outside, I locked the door. Mm-hmm. I, I, I let them out. I let them walk down the block. I watched them till they become dots in yes. the distance. <laughs> dots in the distance. And then I looked up and I said, yeah! <laughs> And I ran around the block. Yo, I, a I championship. ran up to Bedford, oh my down, gosh, and around man. the block and came back in the crib. I swear oh to God. Oh my God. I swear to God. I, I That's too. how much little boys care about being virgins, not yes. being virgins no more, bro. Yes. I waited till they was gone. <laughs> got stamped. <laughs> You got stamped. You got stamped. You stamped Dude. yourself in history. Yeah, man. And I motherfucking ran around the goddamn block. Liz, what's up, man? I seen you out there, Liz, and I did not have a chance to say um hi to you. Shout out to everybody that was there. Facts. Love you. Love y'all. Yep. And then you ran. Look at today. She know. But she know. You know what's funny? You said some shit that really made a lot. Yo, pussy is really an acquired taste. You know, like you. Nobody likes. I ain't like pussy the first time I, I ain't like did either. I ain't like beer. Yeah, I ain't like most that. things that I like now you ain't like before. It because there's <clears> a different <throat> palate as a child than as an adult. Your palate changes. You look for sugar and things like that. And as you get older, you look uh-huh. for more elegance and. I you know. I used to start liking pussy eating until like last week. Some pussies be a little. I ain't gonna lie, pussies was a little. I I couldn't tolerate eating box until I was about maybe. Shit, like, nah, I say like maybe 18. Man. Like 18. You ever ate a box that you ain't like the taste? Yeah. And told her? Once. How do you have that conversation? She had just came back from Tulum. I told her pussy tastes like Cinco de Mayo. Oh. That's cool. Yeah. That's tequila. Mm-hmm. That's a uh, little lime. Yeah. 
I was like, what, what, what is it? I was like, salt. I'm like, what's that special that brown salt that they be putting around yeah, there? Yeah, I was like, what, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> they put around the rim. Yeah, around the rim. <laughs> which one? Which part of the margarita does she taste like, my nigga? Oh, she tastes like the fucking cup. Like it just tastes like you was out in Tulum. Tajine. You feel me? Tajine. There we go. Everything. I was like, oh. yo, what was that? It's like really, honestly. I was like, yeah. I've never honestly told a chick that she tasted bad though. I would just t- eat it. T- po- not you know. What's the worst sexual honesty that you've ever had to hear about yourself? What's something that somebody had to tell you, like you know, because obviously we're talking about if you had to tell a woman that you didn't enjoy the taste, something's wrong, right? Has somebody ever had to come to you about your sex and tell you something that you did not find enjoyable? About your performance. Do you give me a second? What? Give me a second. Give you a second? Yeah. It's happened to me, and I told y'all already um, <clears throat> about the time I nutted quick. Shorty was riding me, or I was riding her. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> that just sounds nuts. I just, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it that way, but you know what I mean. I was either on top or she was on top. What? But I believe I was on top, and I had to go sell drugs. Because you got a windows, you got certain windows during the day that you know you're gonna make your money. Mm-hmm. And so it was the early morning, I knocked it down, and I nutted. But she ain't come. Oh. And she was very specific. She told oh. me I did not come. Mm-hmm. And I was like, but I gotta go, I got you later. All right? Damn. I grabbed my shit, I jumped in my Range Rover, I took off, went about my business, living my life, uh, I'm good. Life is good. So you thought. Got back to her crib later on that night or the next day didn't realize that she had not been communicating with me as normal because I'm just off doing my thing. We didn't have an argument or nothing. Hey, make you come. I'm sorry. Go about my business. I got things to do. I got time window and drugs. Yeah. Got in the crib. I ate. She climbs on top of me. She starts kissing me. We're kissing. She rides my shit. It was a very specific type of ride. You know the ride where she don't care if you fucking Oh, this is it for her. A, oh, it was one of those. Mm-hmm. She used Grab you a, by the back of your shit and looking at you and just Jesus. getting her shit off, right? Got her shit off. Ah! Ah! And you just sitting here like, oh, this is one of those. I'm sitting here like, what is this? And she took her leg, she got off the dick, and she walked away. My nigga, I'm sitting there dick hard as a motherfucker. Dick just hard as a glass vase, just like... <laughs> Dick harder than calculus. Dick, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I was like, "Yo, where you where you going?" I didn't, I didn't come. And she was like, "I gotta go to work." Oh shit! <laughs> That's really what she said. <laughs> oh Son, my! God. It was so petty. Oh my god! It was so bro. like you did this on purpose, but it was real. Yeah. I got it at that moment. I got it because I realized that's what <clears throat> niggas do to women all the time. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Not properly foreplaying, not going. And, you know, it still happens. You know, sometimes you be tired or sometimes you, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But you can't just give them some like, uh. even Gatorade, I used to like nut and just throw her a vibrator sometimes. I got to go to work. <laughs> Yo, here. If it ain't, if I ain't finished here. Yo, tossing her the vibrator as Yo, a fucking prop is insane, out, son. Bro. You just threw a vibrator at me because you didn't make me nut. I didn't even want to hear the rest of the sentence. Gotta go. <laughs> I didn't want to hear the rest of the sentence. I did not want to hear the rest of that sentence. Really? Oh, God. Sorry. Not being able to please your person. At least I got the toy on deck. So you've never gotten bad sexual honesty? So wasn't really based on my performance, but it was like based on my body. This bitch was telling, pardon me, this girl that I was dealing with at yeah, the time. Yeah, 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 you can't call her bitch. Yeah, yeah, I, I hate, I'm trying to tone down with that. This young lady that I was dealing with at the time mm-hmm. was like, yo, I was feeling more of your stomach than your dick. And I was just like. Nope, I'm out of here. Yeah, and I, I was said, just like. And I was just like. Thank you for the like, well, what? I was like, yo, but what you. But, but, but here's my thing, right? I was like, yo, but what? Here's, but you, if you a nigga, right? All right, look, if you a nigga, how do you think. No, no, how do you think a nigga responded to that? I was like, well, what you mean? <laughs> what you, what you, like, what so you what is saying? It, so what is it, what does that mean, Melly? What, what is, mean? what are the two, two or three different inferences that can you be taken me? from this statement? I was feeling more of your stomach than your dick. Because you didn't have enough dick. 
her? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> so, I don't know. What? I don't, I don't know, bro. She like, like what else can I? If, if I'm feeling like, I'm your feeling stomach more, your... and then I'm feeling your dick, that means you ain't got enough dick. Or oh, I mean, I was just mad fat. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nigga, you ain't got enough dick. Oh my god. No. So. She was like, "Yeah, you was hitting it from missionary, and I just felt your stomach on my on my on my pussy." And I was just like, <laughs> so I, "She felt your I stomach like, on her box." I was like, "What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> what the fuck does that mean, you Kobe Bryant?" Down, you had to drop down low stomachs. I, I, I don't I don't remember, bro. I don't really remember. Now his dick had pillows. But yeah, why was his son? stomach on her pussy? Please, Melly, help me. Why was his stomach on her pussy? Help me. I don't fucking know. How does his dick. Like, how, how old where was were you? I was like maybe was 17, <laughs> 17, 18. How, like, how many oh, times did you man, fuck before that? Me. A lot of times. So I was. <laughs> so. I, <sighs> I, I mean I gained weight but damn I guess I was always telling me like, nigga you falling off like yo you you, you moving crazy cause that was my yeah, my joint for a minute you yeah, feel yeah, me yeah. so when yeah. she said that I was just like damn alright so it wasn't really more so on my like my, my, my performance but when she said that that shit had me mad like self conscious yeah. ain't gonna hold you but was it just sorry, that one bro. time no no fuck it. No, I will say this I wanna uh, say this guys men Work so hard at being that nigga. Facts. You know what I'm saying? Even with the fake shit that we do, Melly. Oh, I remember straightening up my walk because I wanted to give a certain thing when I was coming down the nah, block. Nah, we we're not going here today. I'm oh, talking about, nah, I remember sorry. watching people's laces. Oh, my laces ain't got no swag. My shit gotta be like that. <clears throat> I remember doing certain things specifically to give off a certain aura around what I wanted people to see me as. To take, you know, and I think that men do that very often. You know, we, we, we are very conscious of women finding us, you know, desirable, mm-hmm. of niggas finding us, I want to say, uh, powerful. You know what you did, though, right? What? He dick gauged. Got him. I don't think Got, that's you was dick. You looked at a nigga laces, no. bro. If that's not dick gauged, I don't know what is. I have never looked at a nigga laces. Oh, shit, this nigga tie shit up tight. I've never done that, bro. What? Looking at laces, my nigga? It's the way a nigga walk. Now, I just realized oh, how me? women feel when a nigga kitty lick the pussy. <laughs> because <laughs> as he was talking, I was like, what the fuck is you doing? Like what you trying to do? This is not how you do this. <laughs> what is you doing? This is not, no. no. My, my nigga, if I look up here at sneakers, I like the way they lace their fucking nah. lace. I ain't gonna say, oh, those sneakers is getting mad pussy right there. Like, <laughs> Who is wearing those? His shell tops. Shit out of his bitch. His shell tops. <laughs> nah. I, I didn't say that. I did not say that. You're not, um, you're not alone, no, bro. I've done some corny shit to try to get some box. You have? A chick used to tell me that she used to like, I ain't hear, she didn't tell me this, but I heard her say something like, yeah, it's just some out of nigga with like a nice raspy voice. You feel me? Mm-hmm. So every time she spoke to her, I always act like I just woke up. I was like, yo, alone. I was like, ain't shit, I'm chilling with you. <laughs> with. And she's like, oh my God, why you sound like that? In my head, I'm like, I know it's cause she liked the way a nigga sound like when he just wake up. I like, ain't shit on me. So like, you I'm put chilling. on your sex voice, bro? Nah, that's my job. I just woke up. <laughs> my job, I'm wide awake. Like, it's like 5.40 in the evening. I'm just like. Hello. Yo, what you, what you dealing with, though? Yo, what's up? Mm. Oh, shit. Yeah. Word. <laughs> Uh, oh, I'm about to, I'm about to go grab, I'm about to, I'm about to go nah, grab some food. It sounded like we were talking to each other. Huh? I had to it's jump sure, off the call. It's sure enough I had to it. jump off the call. I was like, sure I, had to, I had to hang I was up. Like, Wait, who's this? Like, <laughs> wrong number. <laughs> this is wrong number. <laughs> yeah, I was on the call like. Nigga said, I bet you looking at your phone like, nigga, what? This bitch ain't sound like this the other night. Hold on. <laughs> she gave me the wrong number. Bro, <laughs> niggas would do anything to get some box, man. Yeah. Oh, my God, yeah. son. But I will say that, men, we do so much trying mm-hmm. to posture and trying to uh, be acceptable. Mm-hmm. And I don't think that there is many rules as far as the way male, as, 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 negatively affecting the male ego as they are for the way men are being told to like, don't touch women's hair. Don't talk about their hair. Don't talk yeah. about their skin color. Like, don't do this. Don't do this. It's offensive. It's this. We don't get that we much don't of it. None of that. I'm not saying there's not none of it because there are things that they talk, they speak about, especially for you, um, dark skinned men and how y'all are fetishized and shit like that. Yeah. So there is, but it's just not as much. Yeah. For men, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And so for a woman to just be able to say like, you're fat and I can hear you breathing, you're sweating. And it's just like, 
Bitch, you know I'm human, right? I'm trying. <laughs> like, bitch. Yeah, I'm trying, you feel me? Why would you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, There's no, you didn't have no nicer way that you could have. Nah. Think, but you can't tell a woman, yo, your stomach was getting in the way of the pussy. She. Can you imagine? Well, man, I get canceled. But I ain't gonna lie, them big girls, they be knowing how to get that stomach out the way. What, like, grab her shit, throw it over it's, the pussy, like, get that. Yo, it's some with a way. You, you ever seen a oh, chick yeah. with the yeah. little well, like, nigga put a put a put the stomach in her pocket like yo put that shit right here. Oh, <laughs> yeah, man. yeah, I'll put the stomach yo, here for later. It's something about a little. It's something about a slight pause. I know her pussy fire. I can't explain it. Like a slight. It's very slight. Pudgy. Box. Don't get crazy. It's yeah. like almost like fake bloated. Like oh, I know her shit tough. Yeah. Oh my Pudgy god. Pudgy box for sure. God. Absolutely. Oh. Absolutely. Damn, son. I had I, I knocked um this one chick down a couple months ago. Form her body form. Shout out to form. Shout out to women who know how they look when they get into fucking doggy style. Oh my god. Shout out to women that know what it looks like. That first time you bend over and arch that back up into the air. And you know just the look of, at, at your cheeks spread and your the that that the lower back dipping into your upper back off the bed and you down on the fucking your head is down on the motherfucking bed and that shit is spread wide. Shout out to the fact that you know you just you just stole you just uh, stole my soul, baby girl. Cause this shit is amazing. You see that? You see that? The drill, yeah, drill. When they talk. Click. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, Bro. when she getting that first, when that Bro. arch is right, and that shit is up in the air, nigga, you gotta take that quick mental screenshot. Click. Bro, Holy shit. one time a girl form was so fire, it took me like two minutes to put it in. I was watching, I had to look, I was like, damn, son, this is for me? Oh my God. This is for me. One time a chick, go ahead, Bloom, finish. No, I said, I, I couldn't finish. That one time it. a chick form was so fire, I couldn't get in the pussy. I ain't gonna hold you. I, I I can see why. Why, bro? It's just what do you like? I can't do this. No, because she was skinny, uh, right? Okay. So when she arched her back, she put her pussy in the air like this, but her body's down. And oh, so that, you gotta get up like this. So you gotta yeah. come you gotta down. Like, you gotta be like six down. nine to get. Yeah, in you kind of gotta like drop dick and shorty. You know what I'm saying? Like you mm -hmm. can hit, yeah. but your dick gotta be able to. You know what I mean? You need a low bed for some shit like that. You need and a curved dick. I wasn't able to hit. I wasn't able to find that. Cur <laughs> What'd you say? All right. This is straight dick, dick shaming. Dick shaming. Yep. <laughs> straight, straight dick shaming. Dick shaming. Okay. Can't, can't do nothing. <laughs> Niggas can't do nothing. But yeah, uh, are you a? Are you? Are you? Do you uh, drop dick? Uh no, I got the bed. I got the perfect bed for that now. I've had that problem before, so now my mattress is universal, made just for me. Like I got a bed that's made just for my fucking style, so I don't have that problem no more. Uh -huh. How? You do realize that you have no idea what I just asked you. You said, "Do I be dropping dick in?" Like, and you made it sound like it was a problem. Yeah, because like, yo, so when you do that, right, like, you gotta like tippy toe to kind of get in the fucking box, my nigga. So like, for me, dropping dick that's is not. when a chick. Why you just did the mic like that? Is on her motherfucking. You say this the couch right here? Yeah. And she her pussy's up in the air like this. Uh huh. You know what I mean? So she's like this. <laughs> and you're dropping dick down into the. What? <laughs> Why are you making this look so awkward? Oh, wait. <laughs> yeah, hey, it's your foot in the sh- <laughs> I was trying to show you. I was trying to show you something. <laughs> I was trying to show you something. This is not, wait a Yo, EA, I'm just letting you know right now, fuck you in that clip, okay? <laughs> Okay, so in any case, what the fuck is this? you got to learn how to drop dick down. If she's in a handstand, things like that. Like I get what you're saying. I like what you're saying. adventurous now. shit. Yeah. But <clears throat> don't try some shit that you're not good for. Like, not don't try to pick mean. up a chick that you can't pick up. Yeah, I stay in my lane. I stay in my lane. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't I've, try to pick I've, chicks up no more. I'm too old. I've attempted to do that before. Yeah, I'm good. But no, I drop dick down. But you know what to do. You got to have good core strength. 
You gotta know what you, you gotta yeah. really be in control of your body for real. Most of those positions that take for you to drop down, you gotta be on some shit. Yeah. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? So mm -hmm. it's like a lot of back here bro. and this. Bro, sex is a sport. I don't give a fuck what if you fucking for real, for real. Like you gotta be. I don't want to say you gotta be like LeBron, but then you gotta have some semi in shapeness to you, my nigga. To have real efficient sex, bro. To pick a chick up, yeah. One picking a chick up alone be the workout. I gotta fuck you. You gotta not only pick her up, but you gotta dance with it. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Up and down. You gotta know how to keep whole cheek, whole way. You gotta be in rhythm. Rhythm. You know what I'm saying? Shit is not no fun, nigga. What? Man, I signed up for this. Listen, I did not sign up for this, bro. My motherfucking back can't take but so much. But um, okay. <clears throat> it is 50 minutes in. I think it's time to do 106 and Dark. What do you think? I think it's time. I think it's time to do 106 and Dark. I don't have many videos for 106 and Dark. I want to tell y'all why. Because I used them for the live show this weekend. That was by far the craziest selection of videos that we've ever ran through. Yeah. Like. See. The meal prep shit was insane. Let me see if I can find some shit. Hmm. Go ahead, Lone. Talk to these people, them. Well, some of you guys might not know what's about to happen. Oh, some of you guys That's do. Fire. So for those who don't know, let me explain what's going to happen now. This is oh the 106 God. in Dark seg. Oh, Michael Beetle, hold on. This shit look good. Hold up. Nah, I love black women, bro. I love black women, bro. Can I get... Can nah, hold up. Exert respect. Give me my time. Love black women, son. Sexy bitch. Oil duck. What? Oil duck. Why would you put that oil on that skin like that? You look so fucking good. Come here, girl. Mm. Huh? What'd you say? Did you just pass gas? I did. You smell it? Yes. Was that what this was about? <laughs> Wait. Was that, that what was this was being... about? Was it... <laughs> Nigga, was it me? What the fuck? I don't know, but I smell it. It's shit horrible. Nigga, it's, you don't know if you did it or not. Oh, my God. I don't know, Belly. Was it you? What you mean? I'm Melly. not going into that. <laughs> Melly, fuck, was did it... we go this way? No. Something Nigga, see you go. No. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> we going to wait till this shit is done. It's this nigga walked right. I'm there, like, I'm like, why is he doing this? So Yo, you just trying to set a diversion, my nigga? Did you try to sneak attack us? This is Call of Duty. <laughs> nigga set the diversion and dropped the bomb, my nigga. Oh my god. Yo, pr pray for Ben Stock. Uh, but anyway, all right. Before I was really interrupted, <laughs> this is the 106 and Dark segment. As you guys do know, we are fellow sex workers yeah yeah and we do like to show love and shed light to our fellow sex workers for anybody who knows about sex work it's very hard to get your content out there it's very hard to even maintain a fucking social life in general well, i mean social media life in general you're getting your accounts snatched here and there you're getting shadow banned blocked hoopla hoopla so here what we try to do is we try to shed light and spotlight and attention in a in a positive way on our fellow sex workers. We try to display their content. You know, some things might not be for us, some of them might, but one way or another is gonna get exposed, it's gonna get seen, it's gonna get some love. We like to rate these videos on a scale of one to ten based on how freaky it is or how much we like it. Who knows what we're doing today? But in case you guys haven't noticed, this is Mr. 106 and Dark himself. I already yeah. I don't wanna know what he has in the chamber, but we're about to find out. And um here we go. What's up, y'all? How y'all feeling? Um, y'all know my thing. I'm into freak shit. You don't uh, say. We like to watch. We like to play. Um, and so, pardon me. Wait, wait a second. I'm looking at these videos. I want to make sure I give y'all some shit that you have not seen. Ooh. That last video for the 106 Dark on, st dark on stage. What was it? Shout out to Aisha and Fifi for the, for the graphics. Oh yeah, they Melly, killed did you that. like that? They killed that. You see, oh, you didn't see them like that. You didn't see them. The <laughs> graphics. Shout out to Aisha and Fifi. Shout out to Sherm. Yeah. Whoo! Y'all are that. all just just very necessary individuals. I just hope y'all understand that. Um, that's no shit, I yo yo. We'll put believe. them in the Discord. But okay, <clears throat> I'm not gonna be able to find that, so I'm gonna go to the other one. And here we go. So I'm gonna play the one that I was talking about, Melly first. Wait. I'm gonna play that second. Homeboy deserves his respect. I'm gonna show you why. The first video of the <clears throat> Hard or Soft show. Oh. Get the other, but she's coming. She's walking to your fucking car. You 
You played that already. No. You played this already. Yeah, we, yeah, we seen this one before. Ah, oh. this one before. I'm sorry. Hold up. Nah. All right. So I only may have two videos. One, you guys may have seen already, but I find it so fire it needs to come back. This is it. No. Okay. That wasn't that fire. <laughs> that wasn't that fire. The reason I find this fire is because of how I hate to say it, I'm scared to say it, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Him moaning and her talking to him. The fact that he was able to embrace her seducing him and actually giving back um cues, audio cues that she that he liked it. He liked it. Mm, mm, mm. Yo, that shit be fucking with people in their head. Loom, get out your fucking... Yo. I didn't say anything. You rolling your eyes like, oh, you like his moan? I didn't say... Yo. yo. Did I say anything? <laughs> I'm just saying no, that anything. women like when men... When you're connected. Because I've had some women say they don't like to hear a nigga moan. But when you're connected in that way and a guy is giving her back feedback like that, it makes her feel fucking sexy. I bet you him moaning like that, her, her pussy getting wet. You know what's so funny? I didn't know moaning wasn't cool until niggas cut my ass one day. I was like, you like the type of nigga to moan during sex. And I was like, you're not, you're not supposed to do that? Like, I didn't know it wasn't like masculine. I, nigga, I've been moaning my whole look life. Look at the ladies in the court. Hey, look at the last two things. Look, look. Yeah, I love that shit. Look, I love that shit. Yes, moaning is a turn on. I love to hear man moan. Yeah, sexy as fuck. Like, yeah. it's not corny. Nigga, I be in there sounding like Sade. Yes. Yes, that shit fire. But actually speaking to her and actually communicating, knowing how to fucking talk to each other and you know what I mean? Um trigger certain thoughts or whatever mm-hmm. while you're talking mm-hmm. is a very um, skillful thing. Tough. Now, <clears throat> y'all are saying that we've seen these already, so I'm going to play this next one that we've seen, but I need to respect this, this young lady right here. She deserves her fucking respect. <laughs> Come on, son. You seen this? You remember this? Yeah, I remember this. This is all the same video. Yes, I seen it in the thing, but I didn't realize it. I didn't check it off, but yo. Can you explain Damn. this, Lou? Tell me about this. Yo, we have a young lady in her natural habitat, caramel, with the most beautiful butt tats I have ever seen. Getting that shit from the back, from the bike. And she's creaming on this nigga's shaft, right? And she going crazy. But she has her knuckle in her butthole. So meaning she went from her fingertip to the middle she, of, the the finger, to the back of that finger, to the bro. end of the finger, to her knuckle oh being in her asshole God, she's while so she's sexy. taking, and her nails look long as yeah, shit. Yeah, she's so dope. And the nigga not even moving, uh, he just standing there using like a service uh, tool. Oh my God, son, she look all right, son. I ain't gonna fuck. That ass is nuts. So Damn. yeah, Ooh, child. that's the one I was like, nah. And you see that oil? When women oil their bodies up, Yo, if I can't see my reflection in your ass, it's I don't want to. I, I really do too. not enjoy dry body, but I realize that I can't expect you to always be moisturized. Like, you're no, living, you gotta right? be you're going to work. Yeah, but you go to work, whatever. You ain't coming home as soon as you come out, you're just glistening. You know what yeah, I mean? You know what I'm saying? Like, like, but shit, before you get in the bed, go put some shit on. Throw that shit, shit on. Make it look nice. Make your skin look nice. You come in the bed looking all dry and you shit. Had, you ever had Ashy Box before? Yes. <laughs> you got spit shine, that motherfucker? Spit. You got, <laughs> 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 Mr. Spot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, but, yeah. um, okay. Yeah, shout out you. Yeah, like we really this. only, that means, let me see. So if that's the case, that means we did all of these. And the only ones. I, I, I think I might have one. You do? I believe I only have two more videos then. If, if those two, if, if we saw those already. Mm-hmm. But, yo, I ain't gonna lie. After the live show, I have not done much. That's why it's I said fine. we gonna have a short show. It's fine. You know. We wiped out. Yeah. You know what I mean? That was a lot. The first video I find scary, yet turn on. It's weird. How do you? How it's you, like it's so weird how, how I feel you about scared the swinging shit. and turned on. Well, pay attention to what's happening, Melly. You ready? Do I'm I about to stream a video to of a guy. Matter of fact, don't say it. Loom, tell us what's happening. If it's too crazy, I'm not gonna. Damn, that dude look good though. Oh my gosh! Listen, listen, listen. Look at me while you take that dick. Look at me while you take that dick. Look at me. Open your fucking eyes. So Loon, Loon is having the problem. So ba- ba- basically, a guy is standing over the bed. 
while a masked hooded poo shiesty is having sex with his girl having his way and he's talking to her telling her look oh, at him I get it now look at me keep your eyes on me she thick as fuck damn she is thick yo, 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 hey yo hey yo hey yo yo calm down what's wrong with you Oh, Yo, man. is she is she okay? This she look kind of fire, son. She coming. She, she not. Okay. She coming. My problem is why he got one sleeve on and one sleeve off though. <laughs> that like nigga, that just that bothered nigga, the shit out of me. Am I ain't no for that. Push icy no, man. Did. No, he said he push icy. Look at his wrist right there. He's <laughs> dying. He's <laughs> dying. He's <laughs> dying. <laughs> dying. <laughs> I say that nigga dead serious. <laughs> <laughs> dead ass. You know what I'm saying? But shout out to the shout out to the people that that was handle, sexy. Um, that type of work. Um, do you think do that. that you would ever be able to swing? Yeah, I'm not gonna hold you. Yo, that was mad sexy. It is. That was a real sexy scenario. And what I will say is, I am afraid of doing it because I feel if I do it, I might like it. I am in um, talks about it, and um, kind of nervous, but I like I like the thrill. Let's have fun. So we're gonna try it. Go somewhere and um try it. Anyway, um I thought that the dude in that scene was the perfect candidate. He killed it. Yeah. Literally. Look at me. Look at me. Oh, the and nigga he, behind the camera. And he, no, and yeah, and he was telling her, Don't come. You can't come. And so because she's trying to stay loyal to her nigga while the other nigga doing him, she's holding her nut. But and so Finally, Man, how do you hold a nut? She was holding it, Bruh. yeah. And so finally, he was like, "You could nut." And so this time, he's like, "You want nut again?" She's like, "Mm hmm." And he was like, "Go ahead, I ain't even gonna make you hold this time. Go ahead, nut." No, her eyes start crossing and shit. Yeah. If you want to see it, hold on. If you want to see this, obviously, and of course, I tell y'all this every week. You go into your Patreon, you sign up for the Discord, you come in here and you look in the new episode discussion folder every week, every and week. all the videos that I do for 106 and Dark are going to be in there now. This particular video, uh, do they have the video? That was fire, son. The person who it is in the video is Nina Bad. That is N I. Take that shit in. N I N N A underscore B H A D. D. That's Nina Bad underscore Bad. B H you can find what? Her on Twitter. B H what? Bad. B H A D D. Okay. I found her. Well, oh, all right. Loom. Sorry. Loom. Sorry. That um, was fire. I think. I think. I. I. I find. But see, like, like I said, we go to our parties. We, it, people are so novice. Yeah. Swinging like, yo, you go over here. Do you think that your your girl said like, yo, we here? You go fuck her. I won't fuck him. You good with that? He won't be. Yo, why are you why are you why are you fear shaming? Like, like, let's think about this. Let's think about this. You're in a monogamous relationship, you don't want to cheat, but of course you still have, right? Y'all go to this party. The people across from you they start making out at the party, at a dinner, or like a guest house, like you know, like a fight party or something like that, or a game night. The people across from you they start making out. There's nobody else around. They're making out. She's grabbing his shit. Your shorty starts doing it with you. Are you with it? Are you gonna continue? Like, not, she's just with you. Y'all not swinging yet. I'm telling the true story right now, by the way. This happened. This happened. Y'all not swinging yet. You're doing you with your shorty. He's doing him with his shorty. At some point, his shorty comes across the bed and starts sucking your shit with your chick. And your chick peels off of yours and crawls across the bed to him out of fairness because she's letting you get head over here with shorty out of fairness she goes and gets dude head next thing you know y'all are facing each other killing each other's wives on the bed in the room and there was no pre-discussion it just happened naturally because what's the conversation home look like <laughs> Now, I see it. I let's see say it that now. It was a discussion. Let's say that. Let's say that we knew mm -hmm. it was a possibility that we might swing. But this is your first time. What's the conversation going home with, right? Like? <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> yo, just chill out. Chill out. Yo, yo, just chill out. So this is exactly how it's gonna go, right? So <laughs> you got any gum? 
Shout out to Kobe. No, no. Shout out to Kobe. Still got the wheel in his hand. This nigga took the wheel off the car. <laughs> 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 so, uh, so, 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 so you just, like you, you like that type of shit? Like, so how was it? Oh, so you you just gonna you just playing with the nigga feet and shit? Like you, that wasn't in the contract. They were feet. They just feet. Okay, okay. Oh, cool. so you're so, breaking down. What, you're breaking down. Play by play. Play by play. Word. I'm like, oh, so like, I never knew that you you like licking balls and shit. You know, you don't lick my balls. All right. <laughs> you know All right. Now hold on, hold on. I wouldn't even know where to begin. Would you watch? Like, say y'all are on the same bed. Are you watching what you're doing or are you watching what she's doing? So, yo. Because you're worried about his feet and shit. Yo, so. honestly, fair, fair assessment, right? There is one part of me, like, you know why this is crazy? Now, I need you to wait. I'm going to come wait till you get back because you got to understand. You got you to gotta look me in my face when I say this. It's literally like two separate gas tanks. One gas tank is all the way full, full where it's like, Damn, son, a nigga's killing my joint. Like, I'm just watching her scream as he just stroking. I'm watching mm -hmm. her fucking head go back mm -hmm. and forth mm -hmm. as he drilling her and shit. The noises. I'm the watching, noises. I'm hearing what she's saying. Yeah, I'm hearing that noises. pussy yeah. wet. Mm -hmm. I'm hearing that macaroni and cheese while he in there. I, f I feel like she's his bitch right now. Yeah. He got her. And then another part is like, yo, I'm just drilling this nigga bitch and I'm he's watching and I'm just in her shit and my ego getting boosted and I'm like oh I bet you nigga don't hit it like this and I'm just wowing her shit up you know what I'm saying now she's my bitch you feel me so now I'm sitting here I'm like I got one devil here and an angel here and it's I'm sitting here like how do I really feel and that's honestly and truly what I'm conflicted with I don't know how I'm really gonna react. I'm gonna lean one more way towards the other I don't really know if it balances out I don't know you scared me right now because that's one of my fears. <clears throat> if I'm swinging, mm -hmm. don't compete with me, my nigga, on my bitch. <laughs> <laughs> don't be fucking my bitch. Like, I know that nigga don't be fucking you like this. Yeah, what you going to do if you hear that your bitch. So now we competing, we looking at each other. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to enjoy this. This is not about you. And why are you trying to kill my bitch? This bitch got to come tonight. She got to come home with me. Like, I don't want to see a nigga yeah. trying to prove something. Yeah. But please her. Make her feel good. What You trying to please me. Like, you trying to like, because so, you killing her pussy so much that you make you feel like you can't dick. No, worry about her intimately. But so, if you have exactly. his bitch, what, what's your I'm goal? I'm trying to make her feel good. I'm, okay. doing, I'm doing things to make her feel good. I'm not trying to kill the pussy to show nigga that I'm killing your bitch pussy. But making... Okay, so it's two different type of killing killing the pussy. Like killing the I pussy as in, in like the, ramming, but yes, then it's like killing the pussy as in like making her like, damn, this was fucking good. But the objective niggas fuck is differently. The yeah. the objective is the um common word, the word that we need to be paying attention to. If it's the sex is dope and y'all get to ramming because the sex is dope, of course. Mm -hmm. But don't go in, and this is, goes back to the time when I told you I was fucking with the group home chick and she was sucking my dick and her nigga came in the room. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he backed his <laughs> big ass horse dick out. This nigga dick, he had one of them long, thick joints that wouldn't go up. It's just so heavy, the shit went down hard. <laughs> and this nigga backed his shit out and started coming towards the bed. And I'm just looking, I'm sitting there getting head and I'm just like, the gauging? Is that the gauging? That was the gauging. That was the gauging. But that shit was nah, scary. That was you a get all that dick from nigga. That was a little more than gauging. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, that was an analysis. So that shit was huge. Why Whoa. are you coming over here with that? <laughs> you a dick bailiff, nigga. <laughs> Stephen A. Dick, nigga. What the fuck is you talking about? That was a little. Different. That was a little more than just gauging. That bro. was very. This is, this is DSPN. <laughs> what the fuck is going on here, nigga? Yes. Nigga, this nigga is nuts, bro. DSPN what is nuts. What the fuck nuts. is going on here? Son? DSPN <laughs> is nuts. Nigga say you. And my dumb ass knew what you was talking about. I'm like, yeah, this nigga shit is a hang. I'm like, wait, why? 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 why why do I know what that is? <laughs> He's got the you know what nigga just, just, just nigga defy, they twist him in the air like nigga, <laughs> nigga dick defy gravity. Nigga shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah nigga. Hard, you know, like, gravity don't support hell? your shit. Nigga. All right, eggplant. The fuck? <laughs> fuck is going on? Eggplant. Here? I did. All right, eggplant. <laughs> you know what I mean? Shit. Nigga comes in the room, takes yeah. his shit off, and I see this because I've never seen it. You know, nothing like this before. <laughs> 
the ship's huge. <laughs> and the shit was twisting in the air. Oh, nah, son. Cause it was like twisting around. It was like, it was like Wonder Woman last show. Yeah. This nigga comes Tell the in. truth, nigga. He starts fucking her. <laughs> While I'm getting head, I'm just on the bench chilling, smoking, I'm getting head. We know we're chilling, just chilling. Yeah. Wasn't even no TV in the room, so we was really chilling. Yeah. She comes in, and he comes in, he starts dri drilling off the gate. Because he knew I was fucking his group home chick. Mm -hmm. But she was my shorty first. Yeah. She was my jump. But you trying to get all mm -hmm. with her, which See? is cool. That's so that's what so that so but that's my, that's my what jump. Tahoe's so why, saying. If you yeah. already know I'm fucking her, why, why are you getting personal about it? His feelings is in it. So I feel like, see, that's the issue with men, like their egos. So when you swing, when you're swinging or doing, you know, yeah. things like that, you have to find the right couple. Mm -hmm. You can't find a man that's like, okay, you yeah. know, he's yeah. have, like competing with you or he's trying to show you. off or something like it's that. About like her. Yeah. So it's so that's like really tricky. Like that's I feel like that's a tough. I will. And say you will this. never. You will never know. Sometimes I will say this. Never I know. am scared of the swinging idea. I am gonna do it. Some thing, and you know, go to a party where the swing is at, and you you know you swap with her. But it's, I'm 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 so nervous because I don't know how I'm gonna react. And I've been thinking like, yo, should I bring my gun? Knowing <laughs> like, you, you were like, like, please. What? But I'm just like, yeah, I didn't. No, know I'm it. dead ass. <laughs> should I bring it? <laughs> yeah, should I bring you know what it? Saying? But um, I do think that if we're gonna be into uh, this king shit, your mind should be open. You should have an open mind. So I'm I'm open minded. We'll see. Yeah, I, I respect you for it. You feel me? Um, because that definitely was a topic for me too. It's funny you just say that. Now, should be over that being said, Loon. Yes, sir. I have another video for 106 and Dark, and then we can start the show. Let's see. I think we're gonna have a short episode today. <laughs> y'all are on time in today. Y'all are fucking. Y'all are lit. Y'all got some pussy today this weekend. Yes, sir. You got some pussy this weekend, didn't you? She did. Melly, Melly, got Melly you got some pussy this weekend? Yeah, she did. Huh? Oh, you ain't saying no, though. Oh. Not yeah. like with the women. Not like with someone else. I'm not. Melly said, pussy is sleep to me, nigga. Come uh, on. Let's go. I am My pussy. What the fuck is this, Loon? Can you explain? This young lady has her mouth open. For starters, shout out to her having a clean tongue. I respect it. But she... Yeah, 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 yeah. Just let it, no, play the whole video. Cause I'm this nigga. Bro, her fucking throat is like a fucking elevated door that just glitching. The shit just. You giving that goo 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 ga ga. Like, I never. Your mouth. I need some of that. Where you at? I'm coming right now, Miss Molly. Miss Molly is. I don't even know how to explain it. Her esophagus. What do you call the. Like her esophagus? It's just like open and closing like a Drano. Like just. Uh, 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 it almost looks like a. Like a pussy with a button that yeah. controls it bro oh um, my god I am I like that? not interested <laughs> hard pass that doesn't look sexy to me I would put my dick in that that shit going yeah, it's that like, shit like job the hut or some it's shit it's like it's hugging your penis like. yeah I don't know but, but why it's not teeth so it it's looks, soft I don't you don't have to do that you can do it while it's in there but I don't need to see it. Don't send me a video like, oh, you want to talk to this bro? Like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. The it. visual, oh, yeah. That girl looks crazy. I'd rather you, you do it to check. me and I ask you what's going on in there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, that's, I don't know what's worse. That or, which one is, which one is worse? The, that one or the, the girl send you a video with her forearm in her butthole writing it? Definitely the girl with the forearm and the asshole. Because what am I going to do with I'm that? I'm more. What am I going to do with that? What are you more inclined to do? Put your head into Jabba the Hutt or your forearm <laughs> in Jabba the Butt? <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. What would you do more? Well, due to the fact I do have an anal problem, I'm definitely going in that ass. So I can find, I like, I'm like, listen, bitch, if you, pardon me, listen, ma'am, if you can take an elbow, you can handle this. this nigga so I am more, problem. I am more inclined to get wait, that ass. Wait a minute, you know I got an anal problem. <laughs> what do you mean you have an anal problem? Y'all know, y'all seen yeah, what I happened. Mean, I got an anal problem. What's an anal problem? I can't find no chick that could take this. <laughs> Seriously, I've only found one in my entire life, and that was, I wasn't really, you feel, I, that was even full power. You set yourself up for that. What? You asked. The nigga said I still 
You asked. I still have not found a chick that can take this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'm on a quest. Hey, you know what's funny? Hold on. Oh. Y'all know. Oh, Melly, shit. please give me the camera on this. Oh, Y'all shit. know me and Loon. Ah, oh, we dicked out. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> we dicked out. <laughs> we dicked out. We were supposed to do these cloner oh, willies. Shit. We bought cloner willies. And yeah. we were supposed to auction our penises. <laughs> and the day before, me and Loom was like, uh, Yo, look, listen, I don't know about that. I don't know about that just floating around. I'm going to be honest with you. I pussied out, no pun intended. Well, dicked out. I literally, I, every time I thought about it, my shit just couldn't reach full power. I was like, yo, work, work, work. It just refused. And I was not okay with putting out 65% power. Like, no, you're not about to sit here and just have me. Kyle shit comes on stage. Oh, shit. And tries to auction my shit. And I'm like, man, I don't know if I really want to do this. I think I'd rather mm-hmm. um, <laughs> use both of mine on one person. She, mm-hmm. she was like, nah, fuck that. I'm going to auction this shit. She stood up. She's like, all right, can I get 50 for Tahoe's dick? The room said, shh. <laughs> <laughs> and I ain't going to I'm sitting over here. I'm sitting over here like, look, I'm sitting over here like this. Like. <laughs> I'm like, wait, nobody wants this shit. Wait, I was like, I was Kasha, like, please don't put my dick on sale. She said, just give me back. Just give me my dick back. She said, all right, 55. Yeah. And then Shorty in the front was like, I mean, I'm supposed to just get it right here. Like, where is it? Do I get the dick or do, like, what do I get? And I'm like, Shorty, it's over. I don't want to sell it, and nobody else wants it. Thank you for making me feel like at least somebody wants my dick. But give my dick. I'm going home. <laughs> okay. I, it, it takes a real nigga to do that. I ain't go front. Fuck it. I honestly didn't want to sell it, but I, I want to sell it. I ain't really want somebody to just have my dick. I guess it sounded good. Yeah, like it's, it's it, you know, I, listen. But wait, I'm okay you, with failing. I tried. And you I can just, see yourself a sex, um, like a symbol. Sex symbol? Mm-hmm. Nah. What's the definition of a sex symbol? I don't know. Like LL Cool J. What is the definition of a sex symbol, Melly? Give me that. Pause. Play. <laughs> you said resume. All right, sex symbol. A person widely noted for their sexual attractiveness. Being called a sex symbol is better than being called a... I don't know what the fuck that is. A haddock? What the hell? Um, To be honest, I think you're probably the sex symbol more than me. I'm not really known for, like, just being a sex Sex nigga. You think I'm sexy? No, I said a sex nigga. (laughs) There was no why. (laughs) There was no why. Pause on the why. (laughs) But, yeah, you definitely give off, like, I like sex. And I'm good at sex. Yeah, I believe so I that. can see I can see that more so being you than me. I don't really give that. Um, I'm like a sneaky gem. <laughs> Let's do these videos real quick. We only got two, right? Do we have two or three? Two, two. Because yeah. Shorty with the booty and the finger and all the way in her ass while she rides dick. That's a that's a ten. Yeah, I yeah. honestly believe that. Mm-hmm. From I do believe that you give off what she said you give off. What do I give um, off? But um, I believe that that's an all time time. That's a that's a she made this legendary. What? Her riding her dick with her oh, finger yeah, down yeah, to the yeah. knuckle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Her yeah. riding it with her finger down to the knuckle yeah. and that greased up butt and yeah. she moaning and she... Oh, shorty. Bro, you she win. Was... Shorty, you fucking win. Um, Did you do... Was that your your your, your soprano yeah. voice? Yeah. You fucking you win. You fucking win. <laughs> you won. <laughs> <laughs> not, the, not Tony Soprano. <laughs> you just gave Tony... Let's go oh, to the first shit. <laughs> the first video, uh, which is, what was the first video? Oh. I don't remember. Take that dick. Oh, shit. Definitely. A, that's Take a, that dick. Is this like or freak? What are we doing today? Uh, it, it's a 10 on both scales, to be honest. I can't tell both uh, like and 10 freak. Yeah. Well, I liked it because something about that shit, I don't know. She was thick as shit. Do you think that you can handle the mental shit that comes with? Sharing your lady, yo, bro. I'm not even gonna hold. Yo, listen. I like to be very honest on this podcast when I'm not lying, and um, I will say that I honestly don't know. Like I seen, well, they spoke about. I seen like Dodge do it right in front of me yeah. at a play yeah. one time with Gunner, and she was like cheering this nigga on like a cheerleader, and I was saying like, okay, interesting. Almost the same way homie was doing the video. Nah, he was a little way. He was giving, he was coaching her like, nigga, there's a pick but coming. Go I left. I think I'd rather really? coach. So here's the thing. Say you are in a swinging party. Drill Jackson. So would you rather coach? Or be a fan? Or um, be a part of, be, would you rather coach 
or let her do her own thing and you don't be a part of it. I would rather coach because at least I feel like I got some kind of control and at least over, like, at least like I got if I'm something. Letting her do her thing over there. Yeah. And I, what if I'm not doing something? Yeah. Then I kind of feel queasy because it's yeah. like I'm waiting for her to stop fucking this nigga. Yeah. Like, it's just like you sitting here just like, like mm-hmm. all right. Like how do you? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm Unless. Saying? You get up and you like, yeah, kill that. Yeah, get nah, up. Like, nah, nigga, fuck back, nigga. <laughs> nigga, you better fuck back. Don't let her win. Oh, you're just gonna let this nigga like, fuck you? you. Gonna let this nigga, oh, then, you gotta take that dick. But then you, I don't know that atmosphere. Like, are you the corny boyfriend that's trying to act like you're not nervous that your bitch is fucking another nigga uh-huh. because you're now in here acting like you're a fucking chili? The nigga, if you don't go get something to drink, the answer is yes. Busy. I am the nigga that's just covering up his fear and corniness by trying to be fucking Pat Riley. Shout out to uh, Hito. Yo, Hito, we love you, bro. This, this, this community yes, loves you sir. so much. Um, yeah. I don't they know, said bro. Loon told like nine lives at the at the live show. It was definitely like four. Lives. It was four. Bro, what's up with four. you and lying? I didn't lie. You just lied again. No, I did not. You know you lied. I didn't lie. You just lied again. What did I lie about? All right. Um, He's working in high pitch. What I Millie, lie? where are we going with the swinging video? Swinging. <clears throat> Was this um, 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 take that dick. Look at me. You can't come yet. Now you can come. Who's shiesty? One arm David Banner, son. That nigga uh, meant business. Come on now, Millie. I'll give it a nine. Nine. Okay. That video got a 19. Yes, sir. Now we go into the sphincter esophagus, the one that goes. <laughs> what are we giving it? Reference of what we don't like, right? We're doing freaky. Let's do freakiness. Make it more fair. I'll give it a eight for freakiness. Only because I've never seen nothing like that before. Like Have not that to much throat. No. <clears throat> Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. <clears throat> I just keep clearing my throat. I'm trying to do it. Hold on. Mm. Let the record show I'm not looking at this nigga right now. <laughs> nah, I can't. Do, do Wait, not hold, on, hold, hold your on. mouth wide open and try to manipulate your throat right now on this podcast, my nigga. Please. Nah, I can't do it. Look, look, let's let's keep some some semblance, some masculinity in here. Shit, I said dance like sexuality. Shit, I said dance like Michael Jackson. Nigga, I can't do that. Um, Melly, throat magic. <laughs> throat works. I'll give it an eight too. All right, swinging video. It is. I would like to know from the people out there if you are swingers or if you are interested, some of your questions, um, some of your information, if you've done it before. You know what I'm saying? Reach out to me. Help support me as I go through this. Um, And you can hit me up on Twitter or Instagram if you've had experience at Tahoe TV or you can hit uh, the Heart of Soft show um, with information or whatever and we can repost it on Instagram or whatever or talk about it on the show. Now, the time yes, has come. <sighs> Welcome to the Hard or Soft Show. The show where we talk about the things men like about sex and the things men don't like about sex. The things that make us hard and the things that make us... What is this? What do you do? What do you I can't do keep the flex. They soft. Hurry up. Soft. <sighs> <laughs> this nigga needed a coach. <laughs> I'm sitting here with my debonair co-host, King Loon, the first, otherwise known as, yo, why did the whole crowd know that the pissed name? Me off. Oh yeah, that's why I didn't like, that's why I didn't like, I didn't like that, I didn't like that. Dr. Like like Tone, and then they all said, I'm out. If y'all wanna, if y'all wanna make it to see another live show, y'all will not call me that, okay? Y'all not the, nobody called him Doctor. No, doctor, no, doctor, no, doctor, no, 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 nobody did not, that. No, Everybody no, said Doctor. No, 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 no. no, no, no. If, if everyone likes it, you have to embrace no. it. I said no. What is wrong with you? I said it's nothing bad. I don't. It's listen, a, actually an amazing listen, thing. This is this is the People shit that lo- see, women I, love. Head. Yes, y'all, y'all, y'all lucky he's still on trial. I ain't gonna You're the king of head. No, I don't want to be the. I don't want to be king head. You was just manipulating your throat. No, I was trying. I failed. So you want to be king head? Only people. I, I've never done that. I've never been like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never doing that on a regular day on a Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh my, my brother, God. I have asked you several questions already. One of which is, did you dick get wet? But yes. 
That doesn't necessarily mean that's what made you hard. So what made you hard this week? So it's actually funny that you brought up the whole swinging thing because that is something that I was just speaking about. Really? Yeah. Um, this is a conversation that was initiated some weeks ago, but it was about going to DR, mm. you know? And the girl that I'm traveling with, I said, look, listen, if I see some bad bitches in DR, I want to fuck them, mm. you know? Just putting it out there. Best. And she was like, okay, well, what if I see a nigga that I want to fuck? Can I fuck him and maybe you fuck his chick? And I was just like, damn. That I, sounds mathematically accurate. I yes. was like, it kind of makes sense. It don't sound yes. that bad. But <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. You feel me? <laughs> but the first thought about it was like, you know what? Maybe it's not that bad. And they did give me a little arouse because I was thinking about that angel. Like, yo, you know, like it's a swap. Like yeah. this is some because I'm also like a nigga. I like to feel like a rush. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like you ever like drove your car really fast on the highway? Like to the point that you can't make no mistakes. Mm -hmm. Like you feel your shit just beating or mm -hmm. you about to do some illegal shit you probably shouldn't do. It's just like, I like that adrenaline. I don't feel that often. I kind of look for that sometimes. Mm -hmm. It's like, damn, I'm about to do this shit. Now my blood pressure's rising. I'm getting nervous. I kind of fucking like that shit a little mm -hmm. bit. I ain't going front. Mm -hmm. So it kind of did get me kind of horny. Mm -hmm. Just the thought of it. Mm -hmm. I ain't going front. Yeah, I agree. Mm -hmm. I actually get the same exact feeling. And I think that um, Are we most crazy? people that I spoke to. No, I spoke to a couple people about it. And um, they were like, yo, the first time you do it, it's... Uh, there's definitely, you definitely need room for your mental and emotional, uh, <laughs> um, it's a switch. It's a, you have to adjust, you know what I mean? Because you know, they don't know each other. You know, y'all are here together and you know you was just fucking some chick. So it's the same, it's, you know what I mean? But, but, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> And so is it, you know, that's just, that's the whole thing. So um, yeah, I'm not a, I'm not a, a professional at it. Uh, I shout out to the people who have found peace in that life, and it's like, yo, I love that we can I can share this stuff with my my husband. I don't have to cheat. Mm -hmm. I don't have to, you know what I mean. We go out, we have our fun together. We go home, we get back to it. I you know see. What I mean, I kind of I love I love the idea of that, but I am nervous. I say that to say, you remember your first day of sanitation. <laughs> <laughs> don't don't chill crazy, out. Nigga, you work me. for sanitation. It's like what your tenth year on the job so far. Twelve, thirteen. You remember your first year, your first day of work? How you felt? Yeah, my it's kind of freezing. But like, and like I'm, I'm on sanitation. Like you yeah. know, like you kind of get like a mm -hmm. ooh. I, it's like a feeling you can't really mm -hmm. emulate because now you don't feel shit when you go to work. It's like mm -hmm. oh, I can't wait to clock out. I've been having sex for so long, and I felt like I've mastered sex. So it's like now Master's I don't crazy. I don't yeah. really get to feel like that sexually. Ever, you know, unless I'm getting some new box, but you get the new box once or twice, then that feeling goes away. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of like, what can I do to get that feeling sexually? You and know, I, you gotta be a novice again. Yes, correct. And I think that's the thing that kind of excites me. It gives me a chance to actually wow. feel something wow. again because I haven't felt something in so long. I'm gonna keep it real with you. you know what I'm I um, I disagree, or I don't disagree. Okay. I differ. Okay. How? I get, what was the statement that you just made? That you get aroused? What was the statement you just made? Yeah, I get aroused, I get excited, all that. Yeah, I get nervous. Because I think about the thoughts in my head and mm -hmm. if I'm gonna see this person, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. They say how I'm gonna view myself and, but it's cause I'm not in that light, I don't, you know what I mean? So yeah. I, I, you know, as you said, mm -hmm. I'm like, yo, fuck it, yo, let's go do something. Yeah. Fuck it. Fuck it. You know what I mean? So. Same shit I said at the first play party. Yo, just fucking him here. Let me just. If I'm out. in the bathroom all night, though, y'all know. <laughs> if, by the way, if I come to the swear party and y'all see me in the bathroom all night, just know I'm looning. Just shut out because I'm nervous. It's, it's, it's too much going on. She's out there with that nigga. Can you go check on her and make sure she's not done yet? <laughs> also, stop she's sending me bathroom yet. shit. Nah, it's all right. It's enough. They still send they me send ba you bathroom Yo, juice? nigga, hold me bathroom bane last week. You wore a bathroom bane. Can somebody put that on a cartoon? No, do not. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the merch that we had at the live show. Shout out to those who got their hand on some merch at the live show. Yes, sir. We may be releasing it soon. It was just a limited release. I was thinking about doing some things. Wilson has his own clothing line Facts. with the hard or soft uh, brand. Mm -hmm. And Wilson was getting his shit off. Shout Definitely out to the was. sex guard. Um, boop, 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 boop. Let's get into the heart. The things men like about sex 
the things that make us hard. Loom, what you got? So, this isn't actually, I guess masturbation is kind of sex, right? Can we mm-hmm. consider that? Yo, you ever like took a, nah, I can't say that. Mm-mm. Nope. Mm-mm. What you was going to say, bro? <laughs> this is going to sound crazy. You started. Yo, you ever like seen somebody that was so bad, you took like a mental screenshot and jerked off to the to the memory later? Mm. Oh, you're a predator. <laughs> Oh, did I do it or did I not? <laughs> you're a predator. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my you're, God! You're a predator. Oh. oh, I didn't know. Son, I uh, ain't. fuck. Listen, <laughs> look, listen. I used to say, "Well, <laughs> well, we got a predator." Uh, the show's over. Uh, I did, I'm not acting on it. Like I will that's never. Not predator. That's just. It's weird. Don't it's weird. A, a mental picture. Of yeah, me like a mental screenshot. Me. Yeah. What? Yeah. What? Yes, it's happened. No, that's violation. So I didn't consent to this. So let me ask you a question. But you do not have you do not have like, my consent to use my astral image sexually. But let me ask you a question. Have you ever did it? No. You're lying. But it's like thinking I'm not jerking off somebody the way this person looks. Unless it was like I was like seven. You're thinking of some it's the same thing as just thinking of, about the person. What's the same so shit, you have a yeah. picture in your so mind of the you. person a visual. Let's think about this. Let's think about this. Of the I person in your you mind. I'm bugging. But I think you're bugging. What you're bugging. I? Because you're telling me that you're okay with a nigga looking at you on the train on the way to work. Well, I won't know. And going to work and going to work and jerking off at the thought of you on the train. I and for would me, not know. For me, certain urges need to be curtailed because you don't know where the dark part of this urge is. Now you're on the train jerking off, or now you're in the in the alley. <laughs> jerking off. Okay, to now you're going. By. You're going extreme. Like, I am that's going pre- extreme. That's, that's when wild. it becomes. You're taking a picture of somebody you don't even know. He's so weird. I'm weird. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm listening. Go ahead, Melly. No, I'm just saying, like you're going to the extreme. Like when you go further into the the thought of it, and then like you know you tr- start stalking the person, like that oh, becomes. My that's where it starts. Cra- no. Are you? That's, it doesn't I have to even. go. It doesn't have to go with yeah. there, my nigga. Like that bitch was bad. Like showing them black tights, you know. Like you jerking your dick to shorty in the black tights that you saw on the train. Or, Both of y'all are predators. Or Jim? Well, I guess I am. Cause Wait, the ladies, hell? have y'all ever jerked off to uh, either me or Loon or both? Have, have y'all ever had fantasies of me and Loon uh, gang banging you? But um, yeah. So y'all it's have. Gonna, it's gonna slide. Say, that, yeah, it's gonna I definitely thought of my boy Chef. He's a honey. What about famous what people? What the fuck? Look, they say yes, they do. <laughs> yes, yeah, this one like it's Gosh. normal. Like there's nothing. <laughs> but I feel like they know us. No, but I'm not yeah. talking about y'all. Not but just mad yes. Not just what the yes. to wow. What the f- mad it's mad. Yeah, no, what the fuck? Wait, this is to the question. <laughs> yeah, it just says yes. <laughs> All right, relax. You can cover up my <laughs> man. <laughs> um, oh my god. It's different if there's an assumed friendship or something. Even though I ain't gonna hold you, if I found out that my friend jerked off to the thought of me, that would weird me out as well. But a stranger. But you won't know. That's the thing. I sh- I, oh, yeah, you're right. I don't. I, I don't. feel. So how, like. I don't know, man. I feel All like. All right, fuck you too. What, what the happened? fuck? <laughs> 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 I, said, I said just loon. All right. <laughs> you ain't had to. Because that she ain't had to do it like that. She ain't had to do it like that. Just loon. Yo, I'm fucking like, dead, yo, shorty. Son. You could have oh said loon. My, oh, my fucking God. Just loon God. was like her was, kicking me out of the car. That was bad for you. Get hold up. Oh, my God. Hey, man. What the fuck? Yeah, I can listen. come to your voice. All right. Hey, shout out to you. I ain't gonna front, man. Listen. Shout I feel, out to Elite. I feel, elite, I, elite. I feel like as long as as long as you just keep it with you, like as you not as long as you're not disturbing nobody with your urges, I don't really mm. think it's a problem. That's exactly. how I feel. Like That's if you're not making like, somebody uncomfortable, if you're not disturbing them or making them feel awkward or in danger, or you know, I'm okay with that. I think y'all are predators. I know it's mad. It's bitches, fine. It's mad chicks that jerk off to me. But they know you. Or no. there's some level, either they follow you. Yeah, or, they probably follow me. You know what I mean? Like, there's a level of, a, of, of knowing. There's a, some level. But you know that's what I'm mean? saying. Like, yeah. if you see, if so you saying you can't do it to a stranger. I wouldn't do it to a stranger. But if it's, there's some level of us, like, I'm not going to jerk off to Rihanna. No. What if I y'all like y'all, fire. What if y'all make eye contact? I have. No, I'm talking about, like, you and Shorty. You wouldn't jerk off to a bad bitch and make eye contact with? No. Maybe a little, okay, maybe well, a little that's you. Running. 
I, I wouldn't. I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm not going to look at you on the train and just be like, oh, yeah. <laughs> got one. <laughs> we got him. Uh, can't we got wait him. wait to get to know <laughs> well, I'm going to go dumb on this I can't bitch. wait to get off of Franklin. <laughs> I'm going to go dumb on this bitch oh in my head. My wait. I don't think it's that extreme, <laughs> but, you know, but yeah. you don't do it, that's fine. Yeah, Loon, you do it, that's cool, because yeah, I do I it too. Fuck people. I feel like a lot of people do it, people. so. Okay. Yeah, I ain't going to lie. It's it's fucking speak. My hard this week is um, intimacy. Ooh. The reason why I realized that I think that I have a real problem with intimacy. Um, very often in the morning, if Shorty here, I will s pretend like I'm asleep because I know she up and I'm waiting for her to grab the dick or I'm waiting for her to give head or whatever, but I'm, I'm kind of like- In position? Yeah, but I'm quiet. Like I'm, I'm asleep. I act like I'm still asleep. Like I kind of stay, I, I fake sleep. You know what I mean? And I realized that I've been practicing that for so long, so long, so long, that I've removed myself from sharing back in certain ways, right? Like, so when a person, for one, I want to initiate more. I don't want, want to? to. I don't want to wait for you to feel, you know what I mean? For sure, I want to be more, um, I want to be able to return more. And so I was like, yo, we should look at each other while we have sex. We always looking off or close eyes or whatever. Really? We want to stare at you while we have sex. You don't be looking at each other? Mm -mm. That ass? I mean, I do, but like not you, eyes to eyes. Because that's mad intimate. Like, that's very some intimate. shit that make you like fall in love. And yeah, shit. very intimate. Yeah, you don't. Uh, also, uh, kissing um, um, on the oh, walk by. Slow down, bro. On the walk by. Slow down. There's things you that just you can up. do. To, to make a person feel loved, attended to, cared for, like you know where they are in your life. For some reason, they know that you're paying attention to them by the way that y'all fuck with each other. And um, I'm not good at that. I'm super not good at that. And um, I, I, I'm starting to practice doing it more because I believe that a part of my heart or a part of me, my conscience is locked away behind that fear of intimacy. There's a whole section soft part of me that I might let out every once in a while on some like Cinderella shit, you gotta be home by 12. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, you know, maybe nice, but you know, the hard tile pause has to be the ruler. So you can't be soft, but until 12, and you gotta come home, right? But I'm really mm -hmm. doing my best to try. So like this morning I woke up and I reached over and pulled to me myself. Purposely, in my head, I was like, don't do that, bro. You're about to lean over, wait till she, pull, come here, come here. And I started like rubbing her body while we were asleep. And I told, I said, look at me, look at me. And she looked and then, you know. Then, okay. I nutted in FF. <laughs> you know, I told y'all about it already. I want, I but want, I tried the foreplay shit. I wanted to laugh at you, honestly. Okay. But then when I think about it, yo, I could count on one hand how many chicks I've looked in the eye yeah. during sex. It's not. I don't think it's a full hand. It's not a thing. It's not. And it's also <clears throat> very often that when chicks come by, I'm not cuddling. I'll lay there with you. Yeah, like I'll watch a movie. Yeah. We'll fuck. And I'll lay there with you. And watch TV or whatever. And I'll mm -hmm. eat with you. Yeah. But and then sleep. Wrapped up with each other on some. I'm not yeah. doing that unless I fuck with you. Yeah. Like it's gotta be a different level. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah, shout yeah. Out to intimacy. And that is not something that you should do with everyone. I agree. But and look, ugh, I love eye attack, contact and he is learning. That is so sexy. Um <laughs> oh, I'm gonna be Stevie Wonder. Oh <laughs> I'll be right my back God. Here. <laughs> Things men don't like about sex. Things that make us soft. Yo. Why is it so cold in here? It's December 5th. It's freezing. It's freezing in here, right? Yeah. It's cool. Yo. Um, you don't have a I, You know, I do. I'm trying to worry, right? Because uh, oh. so I don't, I don't like no. how sometimes, what, what? I didn't wash my hands. Yeah, we know we didn't know what I'm right. dropping. I'm, I'm <clears throat> Yo, you ever like rubbing it on There was this one time like I pissed after sex and like my shit was like felt mad funny. That ever happened to you before? Yeah, I had gonorrhea. Or chlamydia. So that's why I, 
All right, that's what I was thinking. I don't like no tingles, nigga. That's what I'm saying. You feel me? Like <laughs> I, I don't, don't like no tingles. I feel like <laughs> I, I get one tingle, bro, I'm off to urgent care. Here's the thing, right? <laughs> so here's the thing. When I was younger, I used to play basketball on my shoes and tied. I used to be able to jump out the building. I used to do everything and not give a fuck. If something hurts, I'll be good by two days. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. After you get like into your late twenties or like thirty, early thirties, I don't like that I'm so observant of everything. It's like I be noticing when shit be off. <laughs> I mean, bro, I went to the bathroom to take a piss, and my piss felt so off. And I was like, why does this feel like this? Like, I don't know what it is. You feel me? But then I looked into my lotion, it was something in there. But my softest though, I don't- There's something in your lotion. You can't yeah. tell this kind of story about your dick burning. Yeah, about yeah. peeing and then just be like, oh, it was something else. It was something, you got to tell us. What, okay. So, <laughs> why would you burn it? So I'm I was, sitting here like, why would this be his? Of so, course that's a soft. Hey, nigga, you got syphilis. So you burn it. <laughs> of course so, it's a soft, nigga. So, you know, you, you, got, <laughs> Did you, you wash your hands. You're going to get mad at me again. But Jesus. I sometimes, you know, this is one of the times where I just jerk off of whatever's around. And I was jerking off of like scented body lotion. <laughs> you, like that happened to me before. Yeah, you're not supposed to do no, that. that, happened. I that it's like perfume in there, I think, too. It's, yeah. it's so I had my dick feeling like it was about to fall off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that I'm gonna keep it a buck. I, I had a conversation with Shorty, and um, I was like, "Yo, I'm gonna be honest with you. I've been transparent with you. You feel me? I let you know what I'm doing, what I'm not doing. If you out here fucking niggas, then let me know. Let me know. You feel me? Because like, she's like, what are you talking? Yo, listen, I know my body. Like, I know what I'm saying. You feel me? Like, I had a whole monologue of why she was out here doing dirt. Mm -hmm. And the whole time I was the dirt. Yeah. So there, here we are. What about that is the soft? Is it just a story? It was the fact, it was me being like, sorry, I forgot where I was going with this. <laughs> Why are you looking at it? Was, I had a, it was associated with something. I'm like, it was is the, this something? Because I've done that before. It, what was the soft? Damn, I've used I was Jergens. Going, Relax, bro. Come on, son. Come so on. Jergens was the I think. Why are you using Jergens? So the level of different creams. By the way, shout out to Get the Butters for coming to the live show for helping us with the gift bags. The gift bags were amazing. I love the. He gift was bags. there. No. Oh. They didn't pull up, but the they you know they sent yeah, yeah. the gift bag stuff. So that was fire. Shout out to Get the Butters mm -hmm. at getthebutters.com. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll probably open up um, with an ad for them today. Open the show up, but yeah, yeah um, I've used. Hair grease. I've, been, I've, been, I've, been I've been used there. conditioner. Hair grease. Is there. I've used lotion. Been there. I've used Aquaphor. What's that? Aquaphor is basically like the stuff they put in your tattoos. Oh no, bro! <laughs> no, you did not, son. Oh my god! No, you did not. Son. Hotel lotion, by the way, don't do it. <laughs> yeah. Fellas, protect yourself. Don't oh do it. My Hotel gosh, lotion, that man. shit that they give you, that free shit that's in the bathroom. There's a reason it's free. Fellas, don't do it. Go down, go get you a bottle of um, Vaseline from downstairs and come mm -hmm. back up and get right. Do do not use that whatever the fuck they got in the little box in the shower. That shit will fuck your shit up. Yeah. Look, that free shit is creamy water. Look, <laughs> look Tyson, I use alcohol for my screen. So, yo, dead ass, yo, Ty, Aquaphor is thick, bro. When I tell you, not great for the action at hand. No pun intended? The action at hand. You see what I did there? You didn't even see what you did there. I did not. You did. Um, My soft. Had an interesting day, week or so. And I realized that my soft sexually as a man is my ego. I hate being weak. I hate that we are so propped up on what the world thinks about us or what we think about us or whatever. We scared to live. Yeah. And I hate that we push that on the people around us, our partners. You know what I mean? The people we date in. Like even when it comes to uh somebody was like, "Yo, you niggas, you niggas are uh, be getting or you niggas be doing acts of service. I just want to let y'all know that's tricking. What a nigga said that you heard somebody say that? So, yeah, I, I seen it. I replied to it and I was like, So, why well, can't want to do something for my bitch? Why yeah. is you niggas worried about what I want to do with my bitch? Yeah, why does it matter? Why does it matter so much? We don't know each other. 
You and I are not on the same. We don't we don't cross paths or nothing. But you're worried about me treating my bitch good. And now, so because of it, because I feel the aggression <laughs> from the masses, I now become less. I do less for my chick because the mass is going to judge. It's not manly enough. You know what I mean? And I find that to be very debilitating from up. Uh, shout out to the men that can get the fuck out of drive. Fuck the niggas. Fuck judgment. Fuck everybody else that don't like what you're doing. And you go off and do what the fuck you. Shout out to you, my nigga. Shout out to that. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? But to us niggas that worry so much about what the world thinks, you're cheating yourself, bro. I'm gonna you're keep yourself. I'm gonna keep it a <clears> hundred. <throat> I was broke as shit when I was a kid. I mean, we all was for the most part. I had one pair of uptowns to last me the whole summer. I love a nigga from Brooklyn. We love uptowns. Mm -hmm. It's not like a fresh pair of Air Whites. Mm -hmm. You know how you treat your uptowns when you like them? You don't even want to walk, my mm -hmm. nigga. You almost don't even want to put them on, mm -hmm. nigga. I'm, I got the toothbrush in my pocket, so just in case some shit happens, I'm on the scene of the crime as it you. happens. I believe you. <laughs> right I back in. You. I'm fresh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I put this shit back in the box, and I make sure the box is clean. My nigga, you wanna know why? Cause I loved my kicks. Mm -hmm. My whole thing is if I love women, why would I not treat women better than I treat my kicks? A nigga who don't treat Damn, his nigga. woman like nice shows me you don't really like women. If you oh, like you women, like or cause he's talking you about really he's like talking her. about tricking. Like, yeah. oh, act of service is tricking. How? And if I like women, if I find a woman that I like, why would I not trick on my on my shorty? How why would I not do some shit nice? Who cares who what is tricking? Like, nigga, I like it. I like her. I want nigga. to spend money on mines. Yeah, what the fuck? Yeah, Do whatever. you mind, my nigga? Is that okay, sir? Yo, my nigga. Yo, I don't spend no money on my bitch, my nigga. So yeah. Salute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, nigga. Fuck you, bitches. <laughs> MOB. MOB. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. Um, Are you dumb? At the nigga? end of the day, fellas, Yo, in you. this world, we have become so weak because we're, we're off trying to define masculinity with every single one of our actions. We're trying to say, okay, this is what men do. This is what men should do. This, And it's like, yo, bro. Treat care of your family. Take care of your woman. Fuck her. Love her. Good. Cherish her. Take care of your children. Fact. Provide for them. Shelter them. Speak to them. Educate them. Mm -hmm. And do the fuck you. Mm -hmm. Stop worrying about all these other niggas. They not getting no buns out here. They, they not, not getting no pussy. Nigga. They not. These niggas not getting no pussy. They not. You worried about a lot of niggas that is making up things to cover up for their insecurities because they don't have what you have and you're trying to shape what you have to match him mm -hmm. because you are worried about the uh, attention of a man or the uh, opinion of other men. Gosh. And that nigga's not getting nowhere near no pussy like you getting. No, at all. You're worried about the wrong fucking things. Facts. Worry about you, yours, your girlfriend, your kids, and your fucking business. This okay. is hard to solve. Wait. You didn't even ask me what was my heart this week. Because you never have this one. This bitch got a heart. You never fucking have one. Wow. Now you got a heart. The fuck? Wait, I just exited the show mad heart. Yeah, like, why would and you fuck that up? Yo, why would she always like, fuck shit up? That was the smoothest end conclusion ever. That's why I said it afterwards. Wait, after it ended. wait. <laughs> the fuck? What about me? Why I go on the play? <laughs> no, what about me? We can save you until next time. <laughs> the fuck? We just, did Obama. we just did an Obama out, my nigga. I did. Belly was like, <laughs> got him. What about me though? What the fuck? <laughs> no, that's why I said it after. Somebody said save it for next week. I'm dead. <laughs> I do want to <laughs> next week. I do want to say one thing. Do you want to talk about your heart? You could do it next week. Okay, we do it next week. I do want to say uh, one thing. We this during this live show, we opened up with foreplay, but we opened up with the dancer. Yeah, sexy as. Fuck. Shout out to that. Shout out to her, her body, her skill set. Wherever you are, young lady, you are amazing. Mm -mm. That dancer that came out and danced 15 mm -mm. minutes mm -mm. before the show. We had the comedian come out. He did his fucking thing. Yeah. Shout out to the comedian. Um, We have, hmm, how do I say this? This show has been up, it's been down. It's been up and it's been down again. And a lot of y'all, especially that first five, six, seven rows that paid extra to come on down to Kingston Drinks. I love y'all so much, man. That shit don't even make no sense, man. I love y'all so much, man. Because y'all are my community. Like, y'all fuck with me so heavy. 
Mm-hmm. Fuck with it. I love it. Um, this show is, is going someplace. Yeah. And I'm not just talking about DR. We are actively trying to figure out when we will see you in your town. Because we will. So stay tuned. The show. The show. When you say freaky, what's freaky? What you, what you mean by freaky? All right, if I do this, you're not going to tell your friends, right? 